So, uh, do you all, you all need a refresher of what happened last session? Uh, we got our asses kicked. Yeah, you got your asses kicked. <laughs> and, and I honestly don't even remember what happened before that. <laughs> uh, we arrived. The vengeful, vengeful spirit wrecked us. Okay, so let me give you a quick refresher on where you guys currently are and what I assume your motive is, or at least I hope. Murder. <laughs> you guys are currently on a trip to where you think Sal's fault is. And you guys have traveled so far for about, I would say about two, maybe three days. And you guys have made it about 36 miles when you encountered the Revenant. Uh -huh. Okay, okay. After he kind of beat your asses a little bit, <laughs> you guys decided to <laughs> get the fuck away from him and take a little nap. And that is where we're going to continue. I'd say put a little emphasis on kick. <laughs> <laughs> he mauled us. <laughs> what if you guys died? That's the reason I'm not like. He absolutely destroyed you. Bro, he, he had fury swipes on me, bro. I don't even want to hear it. <laughs> 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 That's good. That's so good. Wait, so Joseph, how much all... HP okay. do you have? I have 36 now. Fuck. I'm catching up. But Aren't I'm... we all max? Aren't we all max? Yes, we all long rested. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Catching up to you, Joseph. Uh, I'm 28. The question I should now ask is, would you guys, uh, what pace would you guys like to continue at? The same pace. Yeah, yeah. normal. Is that across the board for everybody? Everyone yes. wants to be normal? Yes, sir. Mr. President, sir. Okay. Ugh. So as you guys are traveling on the first day after the Revenant encounter, you guys finally... Wait, where is it? You guys finally do enter the Thin Sheets area. This is an area of, of more icy terrain. Think of more like the Arctic. Mm -hmm. So... There is a lot less land masses. There are still land masses. Well, we are we are currently looking at camping on fire, GIF. Yeah. <laughs> I know, I'm not showing you. Anything. Oh, okay, okay. Sorry, I thought you meant to. Hold no, the this is just no. The so the thin ice is something that's kind of inhabitable for long times, mainly due to the inconsistency of where the ice actually decides to melt and solidify. So after passing a day, getting to... Oh, no, he's rolling. The demonic sound of a dice roll from a DM. <laughs> Can I just point out that it says camping on fire instead of campfire? Know, yeah, it's camping That's on really fire. distracting to me. It's just camping <laughs> on fire. You don't. There's a body in there. You just can't see it. It's been there for a while. No, Will, you don't sit at the campfire while on fire. <laughs> I'm sorry. Maybe I don't like being that toasty, a little cold-hearted. You know. Well, I don't like being after warm. A day, after a day of traveling, you guys don't encounter anything. Would you like to continue forward with the same pace or going forward? Same pace. Let's same go. Pace. Okay. During the next day, you guys are now 84 miles out. Oh my god. We've all frozen to death. <laughs> <laughs> you have not frozen. My dick <laughs> and balls are freezing. <laughs> so after this day, you guys don't encounter anything. You get 84 miles. On the next day, would you guys like to move same pace? Uh, yes. Yeah. You all die. <laughs> a beholder spawns in front of you, and you all die. <laughs> <laughs> Not even the darkness could save us from that <laughs> shit. As, as, as you guys are walking, someone falls in the water. You guys decide not to help him. He drowns. <laughs> Can we know who? <laughs> no. No. <laughs> he uh, just kicks off from the server. <laughs> <laughs> So wow, the, we're lucky. <laughs> the next day, you guys do encounter something. Oh, never mind. Why do you have to say oh. anything, Gary? Gary, <laughs> why the fuck? 
So as, as you guys are walking, walking through the thin ice caps, uh, with the mountain to your left, you guys come across a pool of shattered ice where a like a lake is forming, but it's more of just where the ice is shattered. Is there something in, in where the... And I will bring you to the screen. Oh, we're meant to find this. Yes. Yeah, shut up, guys. You play only one talking. So as you guys can show you with Ezreal, you, you hear distant whimpering and growling. Dogs? What would you like to do? Uh, can I yell puppy? Uh, you can. You just uh, yell it. Puppy! puppy! <laughs> so as, as, as you yell puppy, you see Slight skittering in the distance. Oh, foxes! Kind of run out of view. Snow Fox! <laughs> Yo, uh, am I gonna be the one to continue the chain of let's kill? <laughs> no, the don't Snow kill Fox. fox. <laughs> don't kill Fox. I like Fox. I, I, in my fascination with small animals, I follow it. I follow behind. I I <laughs> want. I, feel like this guy I want a pet him. fox. Can I get a pet fox? Does someone else want to follow as well? I want to follow. I'm, I'm curious now. Uh, yeah, I'll also follow. I want pet fox. I want a pet fox. I uh, a... Shut the As fuck up, Gary. Approach. No. Would you guys like to do anything before you approach? Uh, can I search the tree? Actually, can we use uh, uh the thing to find out like <laughs> it, it's true tree? intention? I don't what's, know. What's Maybe the they're like. It's true intentions. Is that? I think that's mine. That's mine. Insight. I, I kind of want to do insight just to make sure it's oh, not no, like an evil it. fox. <laughs> Silver yeah, dance. Can, can, <laughs> can I do that? <laughs> uh, so as you approach a little closer, you can start to try to read the fox, and I'll pan the camera up a little bit. Ooh, it's right. <laughs> okay. okay. And can I do insight? Uh, yeah. Go ahead and roll an insight check. How is he so far ahead? Oh, I hate my life. It's a fox. I think it's fucking slow. Eh, it's probably not a huge deal. Whatever. From what you see, you can tell the fox it is kind of scared by you all, but isn't necessarily, like, freaked out. He's more I pull out a ration to try to tempt it towards me. <laughs> We're gonna starve. Do you but have a rat? I have. I can actually tell you how many I have. I have eighteen. Can I? Uh, can I roll an animal handling check to see what the oh, animal's yeah, yeah, intuitions right. are, or like what it's intending to do? Uh, that's intending. insight. Animal handling is like if you want to try to like beckon it over to you and stuff. That's what I'm. That's what I'm trying to do. Think of animal handling like whispering to animals. That's what I'm trying to do. Wait. So, so Joseph, you could pull out your rations and roll an animal handling check. Oh, I have Come 10 on. rations. Come on, rock man. <laughs> I had a 19 when it rolled to a 9! <laughs> <Bruh. laughs> so from the fox's current position, he, he, he sees you kind of approach from behind Wraith and pull out a ration to drop it on the floor. Although he he kind of just stares at you the entire time as you do this. I, I would like to copy... Everyone's gonna give up their rations. Huh? It's okay. one. I, I I now have. Se or is that losing a ration, Brody? Or yes, yeah, said it. Or... <laughs> Where does it go? For now, you could say no because it hasn't eaten it. But I am gonna need to dock some rations just for the amount of days you guys do spend. Unless you how, got one. how many should we get rid of? Well, I'll leave that to Brody. probably around. Do I, we'll do that going a little forward. I'll calculate how many rations you guys ate later. Uh, so intuit an um, animal's intentions with animal handling. Are it's you gonna it's do kind it? of the exact same thing as insight. Animal handling is just kind of getting an animal to trust you. It, it might be a little different, but that's how I'm going to run it for now. Insight is like a person, animal handling is like insight for an animal. Alright. Hey, um, Gary, can I, have, can I, guess, I guess you can roll animal into handling if you want insight but all right i'm gonna i'm gonna walk in front of everybody and push them back and sit on the ground with a ration in my hand 
to see if I can get him to trust me. Uh, wait, the wait, before you do that, get knocked out we'll go ahead and do your roll to see if the fox likes okay. you. Okay, okay, where's my animal handy? Uh, Motherfucker, what? I literally was about to get a 19 and call it. I was gonna put it on my show, though. Dude, so Joseph as really as wanted kind of like pat, the, pat the ground and like try to call it over towards you, it again just starts staring at you. Now, kind of getting annoyed and starting to turn away from you all. <laughs> Ethan, as, as you approach, would you still like I'm to continue like, your previous? Uh, yes, notion? I'd like to like... push. I'd like to push the three idiots back to show that I am trustworthy and alone. I then grab Nornik by the shoulders, pick him up, and throw him in the icy water. <laughs> he drowns. <laughs> Uh, right. Ethan, time to make a new Ethan, character. Oh, Ethan, Constitution. Ethan, go, <laughs> Ethan, go ahead and roll animal handling with disadvantage. Oh, with disadvantage. disadvantage? Oh, yeah, it's, it's, it's annoyed. It's annoyed. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay. Well, I I've rolled, so I'll just roll twice. Okay. So as you approach, you kind of just like, come here, Foxy. I'm I'm friendly. But the fox, like you, you whisper it to a point where the fox could barely even hear you. <laughs> But the fox just doesn't turn around. Very good rolls, <laughs> everyone. Very good rolls. <laughs> the fox then just starts to slowly walk away again. All right, we'll we'll continue to follow. I'll continue to follow at least. I'll follow. <laughs> we'll keep following it. <laughs> I'll, I'll follow by an anniversary. I'll just. Foxes are a good sign. They are. They're lucky life. Dude, they're dude. Persona they are, foxes well. mean good fortune. They also charge you. <laughs> yeah, they're hella fucking stingy, man. Okay, so as you guys try to approach the fox, <laughs> they're a little dewy. <laughs> the, fo the fox kind of just turns back around after hearing your approach and just stares at you again. I'd like I'll, to I'll once again out, try the same also thing. Also, letting out a quick hiss Shh, as he no. kind of gets into a defensive stance. Jesus. Uh, I don't think it's hissing at us. <laughs> throw the rash. Throw the rash. Okay, I was gonna say. I was gonna say. Throw the rash. I'm gonna <laughs> once again try the same tactic. Oh, throw a ration at it. Feed it. Roll with this. <laughs> you want to throw a ration at it, or what are you doing? <laughs> yeah, I'll Feed throw. It. I'll throw a ration at. I'll throw a ration in between it and myself, and keep another ration in my hand. Okay, so go ahead and roll a animal handling check. Still with disadvantage. Yes. <laughs> wow! Wow! <laughs> fucking pelting so, with the ration. Wow. <laughs> so yeah, as, as you throw your little box of rations towards the center, a piece of meat from the box flies out and it hits the box directly in the face. <laughs> oh my god! You're genius! <laughs> oh my god! This annoys the fox more, and now he's kind of, now he's kind of slowly backing away while still looking at you. What a <laughs> We're fucking up getting a box, dude. I want to. Oh my god, you guys. This Holy is uh... unlucky. Hold up, hold up, hold up. Oh, you fucked up twice! Fuck you! Okay, can I actually, I have an idea. Could I create an illusion of another fox, like, with us to kind of make him feel more comfortable, I guess? Should have stolen Togi's dogs. You can try. Shut the fuck up. I'll try it, I'll try it. Luke, Luke, it's never, it's never, a, it's always a try. It's not, there's no, can I? <laughs> I'll try, I'll try. I'm, I want to create like an illusion of a fox just come behind us, I guess, to, no to learn him over. Illusion. Illusion. Oh, fox is rolling a perception check. <laughs> 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 the fox has to make you see, sure. You see the fox pull some glasses, pull some dye and paper. <laughs> This guy's like, hmm, let me analyze Luke. every detail. Luke, do you have fleece? Foxes are very keen, aren't they? Wouldn't they have a do kind I of a higher fleece? percentage? Okay. Yeah, do you have so, fleece? Uh, no. <laughs> then you can't cast that. What? You have to have a, a bit of fleece to cast that spell. He has the tablecloth. It's... Oh, yeah. Well, I thought that was wait, wait. Like that. Wait, minor... No, I'm pretty sure that is... Uh... Yeah, he has the leather tablecloth. Okay. Yeah. I feel so but, bad for Ergon. Not Ergon. Hey, was it Ergon? Elro. 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 
So you want to cast Winter Illusion? Yeah. Okay. Uh, a tiny, essentially, copy of the fox appears behind you and <laughs> walks out to your side, kind of looking in the other fox's general direction. The other fox just hisses at it. So, <laughs> yeah, foxes are keen. They, I'm pretty sure foxes have, would have a higher perception, right? They're little sneaky bastards. Sneaky, sneaky, sneaky. All right. It doesn't like my my fox, man. It's getting bad at him. <laughs> Unless Brody fucking rolled the luckiest roll of his life on a fox <laughs> perception check. <laughs> so what would Shit. you all like to do? I say we just continue and don't mind the fox. Mind the fox. <laughs> Asriel. Can I... Can I, I kill I, the uh, okay, before before Nordic can act, I pick him up by the back of the collar and I start carrying him walking off. <laughs> okay. So oh. you two will walk forward. And the fox kind of like starts skimpering away a little bit. And as you two approach, Ethan, would you like to try to break from his grasp and do anything? Yes. <laughs> I am holding him up. Oh I am holding God. him. Above to my chest, I, by the I way. Would, I, know. I, I know, but you, like, if you're grabbing him by the collar, so he's like, his feet aren't even on the ground, he could still essentially do stuff. I want to wriggle out. <laughs> that was no <laughs> thunderclap. Do, do, do I have to, do do I have to roll a check for this as well? Both of you roll strength check. <laughs> oh my god, what is happening? Oh, well, well he wins. <laughs> oh, a strength save? Oh, check. Didn't matter. <laughs> okay. So e e Ethan is able to kind of like put his hand on yours, Joseph, and push himself off. Ethan, now that Sliding out of his shirt in the process. <laughs> Ethan, now that you're free, what would you like to do? I would like to tell Geary to back the hell up so I can once again try and feed him. No. <laughs> I'm not backing up. I'm not backing up. <laughs> then at least stand behind me. Oh my god. So Ethan, would you like to try with Joseph standing behind you? Yes. Roll double go disadvantage. Ahead. Go ahead and roll a disadvantage of animal handling. No, you didn't. Oh my fucking god. 19 and a 1. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my. <laughs> the, fox, the fox again look looks at you kind of with like a <laughs> and, 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 a confused expression and with that he kind of just starts oh that's a <laughs> <laughs> he starts <laughs> elongating he I thought just, was like oh here comes an evolution he kind of he kind of uh fucking rips through space and time uh stretches unstretches and then disappears so the yeah fo the fox dude. you failed to intimidate time fox how do you feel <laughs> <laughs> what would you guys like to do? Fuck, dude, if only can I was Dio. And you walking up? If only I was Dio. If only. Uh, as your race, what would you guys like to do? Um, uh, I guide my uh, fox, and for the minute let me... left that he has, forward. <laughs> Azrael, did you want to do something else? Can I use jump like insight water, to tell where we the where the fuck we are? Or not insight, insight or like history or something. Uh you can roll a survival check. Okay. Everyone is on the verge of God death. damn, too. <laughs> Love my uh, life. Uh, you are on the thin ice. Guys, we're on thin ice. Dude, I, I jump really continue, high. Guys. These rolls continue. We do not want to engage in a fight. Uh, I, I'll Already, just follow. Like, I'll follow. like Mario, I jump, do a little uh, front flip, and smash my ass into the ground. <laughs> Would you like to? No. <laughs> okay, so I'm. As you investigate the ground, realizing that, yes, you are indeed on ice, what would you like to do? Would you like to rejoin your party?
Asriel? Yeah, I said yeah earlier. Uh, so you decide to regroup with the party. Would, uh, would all of you like to advance forth to where the fox went, or would you, you guys, what would you like to do? Yeah, Can well, I uh, use my shovel to dig up some of the ice to see if uh, how deep it is? It's uh, sheer ice. Yeah, it's like it's like on an ice shit will crack in half. <laughs> yeah, you're, we're sitting on ice, Ethan, not snow. I know. It, it's like to... yeah, I know. So you can't. If, if you like. crack it, the water will seep in, and then we'll start floating away. Okay, so, so you think, think this fucking shovel is? You think I'm Paul Bunyan or something? You think? Go ahead and make it's a, a sheet of ice, check. dude. Go ahead and make a strength check. Oh no! Natural twenty. So yeah, as actually, you pull yeah. your shovel and start mashing it into the ground, you can't pierce deep enough that the ice goes away. So you're only able, you only ever hit ice. You never hit water. Okay, good sign. All right, with that information, uh, I I ground pound. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's continue forward. I feel like you're just standing on this ice as a risk alone, Joseph. <laughs> yeah, I'm currently 171 pounds, or carrying 171 pounds, and I'm 425 pounds. Just don't jump. Just so, don't uh, jump. Uh, you uh, might as say- you guys continue, you again hear an even louder growl with another whimper. I'm guessing the fox is whimpering. Do you all like to continue forth, or who? It would only one person. Uh, uh, I'll I'm go gonna first. Let Gary go, let Gary go first. I'll follow behind Gary. Have Nornik fall behind, and then Wraith in the back because we're wild. Because stealth, baby. Stealth. stealth. Wait, <laughs> hold on, hold on. Do we want to cast pass without trace and roll stealth? Um, real quick, I need to ask. Do we have to roll initiative? Well, wait, wait, wait. wait. Before, no, 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 actually, no, no. before if we go in, before we go in, does does my blade actually? Like, is my blade blowing or anything? Is there danger afoot? Your blade is not warning you of danger. Okay. What? What the fuck? Why is that so ominous? Right. <laughs> <laughs> okay, okay, okay. But Who's I, it warning I'm like, danger? ask Wraith a question. Alright. You gonna Before drag go. me away? <laughs> yes. I'll bring my I'd fox. Like, I'll no. bring my fox. <laughs> okay. I'd like to quickly, like, walk a little bit, to the, little bit up so nobody else can hear us. Okay. Does that mean we have to go to another caller? As you, as you guys, hey, you know, okay. I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna quickly. You guys are kind of huddled, so you do not see what's up ahead. I say, Rith, <laughs> do you like foxes? <laughs> Why did he move us and not? Change? I don't know. He should have just. That moved literally me. just fucked up a shit ton. God damn it! What? How I have it set up? Is it set up on the actual? It's not that big of a deal. Whatever. I just feel like... Oh. Oh. Oops. I don't know why he did that. Yeah, because you're, cause you're a video. So, you know, so it only hears us right now? Yeah. <laughs> hey, no. YouTube channel. <laughs> it's your boy, J Bug here. Back on the Minecraft video, today we're going to be playing AutoCraft, today we're going to be finding a dungeon, getting diamonds, and making some armor. And that's it. It's called my British Minecraft YouTuber. Skip. Wonderful, wonderful, wonderful. Uh. <clears throat> My cat is giving me the most angry stare. She's so mad at me for what I just said. I feel like the whole internet's angry at you right now. <laughs> How many subscribers you got, homeboy? Hold up, hold up. <laughs> Hold up, hold up, hold up. Uh, Can you hear that? No. Oh, my cat meowed. 150. Mm, so 150 people are angry at me right now. Gosh. I'm one of those people, by the way. Why is he rolling a medicine check? What? Wait, what? <laughs> Hi, guys. Mr. Ruffles here. Wait, why did... Why did... Why did he just roll medicine, Jack? 
<laughs> Don't worry about that. No? Are you guys hurt? <laughs> no, 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 no. You don't, you don't need to worry, dog. You don't need to worry. But I will say this. The medicine check was for me. <laughs> Motherfucker. He's stealing. What? Ethan's... Ethan's... Wait, hold on. Ethan... Oh my god! Why is his sleight of hand so fucking high? So I kind of figured you cheated it. Okay. Who fucking stole? Ethan, why are you stealing? <clears throat> stealing anything. Slide the hand. Okay. <laughs> Here's where we talk a quick oh, lesson fuck. about metagaming. <laughs> Shut the fuck I'm on my character sheet and I just see. <laughs> I just see a like, slide hand 17. <laughs> you're, not, you're not being metagamers enough. So shut up. <laughs> okay. So Luke, go ahead and add. I feel a tingle on my butt and I roll perception. <laughs> So yeah, Luke, go ahead and add three gold coins to your How inventory. Do I? Ethan, How go do I ahead do and that? add three feathers to your inventory. The okay, fuck? so we didn't get more. So we didn't get more. Okay. You plucked feathers <laughs> off of his body. <laughs> <laughs> is that what the slide of is that what the slide of it's a mix of it's a yeah it's definitely a mix of things that happened wait did you need sleight of hand to pull him out or did you just just do something dirty i guess so, who knows so wait i need to add three gold pieces of they weren't said? okay yes. well they weren't close enough to us to do it to have Ethan, make sure, Ethan, make sure you uh, okay. minus two gold pieces off your own I did. Well, it was three. Minus two? Yeah. <laughs> no. Sorry, I'm sorry. Three, you plus three. I wasn't so trying to metagame. I just saw... I know. <laughs> I'm more of just saying that's metagaming as shit. <laughs> just know that. I don't... Wait, what's metagaming? Metagaming is like, oh, my character doesn't know it, but because I know... Dog. <laughs> because, because I know dog. All right, let's, let's, let's get back into it. Back into it. My, my dog just... Okay, I need to put my dog in. Straight. So, uh, so as yeah, me and Ezreal are playing okay, patty I'll, cake, I'll playing meta gaming. So, Luke, it's like if you, since you, if your character doesn't know, but you personally sure know do. what happened, uh, you saying that your character knows because you know that's meta gaming. Uh, you got to keep in mind that your character and yourself know two different things. Well, can can I know at least what what the side like, hand was for? Without, I know like, that my wiener is. I, I if you ask, well, no, because you don't know that I did sleight of hand. Your character doesn't know. You know in well, real yeah. life, but your character has no idea. Because that's what sleight of hand is. Well, no, I'm asking in real life if I can know what you did. I won't. I, I mean, I won't I'll tell. I can tell know. you, but you can't I won't use have that my knowledge know. at all whatsoever. I won't. I'm just curious. Yeah. No, I stole more feathers. Ah, fucking bitch. I, I totally but called that, it, too. But like, me saying that outside of the game... Dude, you your modifier no, for know, side I of know, hand I, I, is I, I, so fast. Well, the whole thing is... I was so, so in between my bed and my desk and essentially dragged my laptop down with her face. <laughs> <laughs> the whole thing is, though, can I... Can I tell if more feathers are missing? Like, I feel like that's kind of an obvious thing. <laughs> well, I mean, you wouldn't know to, like, check that. Check. I can feel I'm being pulled out, dog. <laughs> you feel a pain where, like, in your left to your arm, where the feathers got plucked. You, That's about do it. Do you count like every oh, single oh, hair oh. you have on your head, Luke? Hair. R r r r r r it's a bird. Well, I'm saying I'm what? using that as an example. I mean, I guess if you pulled like, like two different strands of hair, you would feel Joseph oh, Bird doesn't know how many so feathers he has. As Wraith looks at his arm, he sees feathers missing. He realizes he does not count the feathers on his body every single day. <laughs> he doesn't know how many feathers are missing. All right, all right. Okay. So as, 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 as this whole situation is going on, so you two are about out of it for like two turns. Would you like to do anything, Joseph? 
Um, yeah, I'm gonna quickly see. I'm gonna quickly, 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 quickly see how big of the radius is for. Uh, where is it? Hold on. Uh, pass without trace. Um. Oh, it's cell. I don't have the. Oh fuck. Did you not read the material you needed? No, I don't have the um the the area one. Oh, I'd need ashes from a burned leaf of mistletoe and a sp- Okay, never mind, I'm not going to run that. Um <laughs> Oh, I could have run- ah, I could have cast command on that fox. Fuck. Another thing is Nornik has speak with animals. I do too. I don't know why neither of you guys did it. I didn't want to say shit. I didn't want to waste a spell <laughs> slot. Azrael, would you like to do anything? I was just going to fucking I run ahead. Say, Fuck uh, him. Yeah, I'll just, yeah, I was going to say, we'll just run ahead. I'll run me, ahead. Yeah, me, only me and him. Only me and him. Me and Gary. We're buddies now. We're best friends, right, Gary? Yeah. I'm already up. We're already Shut up the fuck ahead. Up. No, we're, we're already up ahead. Yeah, no, you had two you turns. Two are, you two are currently getting uh, surgery. So, <laughs> as you two walk ahead of the... Azrael, I cannot see. <laughs> Uh, open your eyes? Have you tried opening your eyes? Do, do you need me, Do you need help op- with your eyes opening? I I have yeah, right. Go on. I, I, Shut up. I'm gonna. I'll... This is part of the role play. Shut your mouth. <laughs> <laughs> you think I'm, being, you I think I'm your... joking, but I'm kind of serious. Oh, I'm grabbing your head right now with my my, my <laughs> hands and like using my fingers to try to pry your eyelids open. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, oh, no. <laughs> okay, boys. Uh, can you see now? So we have two choices. Yeah, I wish I couldn't. We have, we have two choices. We can go down or up. I'm praying to God you guys don't say up. Okay. Uh, so as you, as you all... That's what I hope I roll a stealth check. Mm-hmm. <laughs> as, as you all approach, you see a small pack of wolves kind of circling a griffin with an arrow in its wing. Can I help it? Ooh. Sorry, I shouldn't have said How do you want to do that? I cast Speak with Animals. Speak with Animals first. Yeah, thank you. Thank you. Save me. Okay. Go ahead and cast Speak with Animals. It has been casted. Uh, what would you like to say? Well, can I Can I also... No, you're not even like... here right now. You're not paying attention. You're currently fucking <laughs> feathers out of Wraith's arm. <laughs> I, I, uh, obviously the, obviously the wolves are attacking the griffin, right? Right now, they are- Or they're, they're gonna turn around, like, they're gonna try to kill it. Yeah. Okay. Uh, I yell into the, into the, the crowd of animals, I, CEASE! What is going on here? The two wolves that you can see- I'm sorry, give me a quick second. Man, that wolf's not crying, though. Wolf? Is that the yeah. wolf? <laughs> no, that is not the wolf. That is my dog. The wolf is coming. Humsky. Dude, when I saw this up, Griffin, I was like, oh god. I was like, please tell me it's fighting the wolves. So, the one wolf in in the front, or at least that from what you can see, kind of steps back from the griffin and looks towards you. And just, he kind of st- he kind of stares at you a little bit, not trying to indulge your conversation. Hmm. Uh, well, I... He's, like, bluffing like he can't hear me. He No, he's not acting like he can't. He's more... Oh, like, he's just not responding. He's, he's kind of squinting at you as, as if to say, like, why are you here? Oh, the okay. wolves are the big one. The wolves. Mm. Can, uh, I okay. I we... completely ignore the wolves and I yell at the griffin. I yeah, I'm yelling and I saying, "We can help." I'm saying, "Are you in need of assistance, mighty griffin?" The the, the griffin kind of looks toward look toward looks towards you and just sit. Just starts screaming back like, "Stay back!" Obviously, okay. Uh, and no he, one, else, Ethan he, can't hear me. Ethan can't hear uh, this either. No, right? one, no one else can hear. It's just you. The Griffin kind of screams, "Stay back! Get, get away from me!" What? What is wrong? What? What is? What is the issue? 
Just stay back. He's trying not. He he just really does not want you here. Do you uh, wish to die? We can save you. <laughs> I'm, I'm not letting this go, motherfucker. <laughs> <laughs> this is the, this is my this is my chair, Brody. <laughs> This is my chair. <laughs> the, 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 the griffin <laughs> stares at you. Now realizing that you are hostile. What? And you just said, would you like to die? I said, I, <laughs> you oh, said that, Joseph. I did, you huh? Did. The griffin stares at you. Now clearly hostile. Now that you are clearly hostile in its eyes, it is now back to a full <laughs> defensive stance. Nice so joke. what did you say? <laughs> not not Just understanding what I said before, curious. I, I continue I continue saying, unless we, <laughs> unless we help you, these wolves will kill you. G Gary, what, what do you say? Cause that, that's an angry looking chicken. <laughs> that's one angry looking chicken. I turn turn to Azrael. Uh, chicken very angry. <laughs> uh, did you hear what I said, Brody? By the way. Uh yes, the Griffin isn't really listening to you, but you can hear out a faint mumble. So you just gotta pick my poison now? The Griffin, what you just essentially asked is, Griffin, if you let, if you can either let these wolves kill you, or <laughs> we can kill you. Alright. <laughs> and obviously this thing can't fly, right? It cannot, no. Okay. Uh, this isn't a concentration spell, is it? It's not. Um, how far away is that first wolf from me? Uh, the first wolf is... And the... Oh, okay, so I'm gonna feet. say this now. 50 feet? Mm-hmm. Uh, I'm gonna walk 20 feet forward and cast, uh, <clears throat> Compelled Duel. And as I'm doing this, I'm yelling back uh, to uh, Wraith and Nornik that about the or, um, Nornik! Wraith, there's a griffin over here! We must rescue it! Uh, so, uh, as he's compelling duel, Azrael, would you like to do anything? Uh, don't, hit the, don't hit the one that I'm... I guess if... Is my... Is my... Is my uh... Is my sword changed at all? Uh, your sword is now faintly glowing. Okay. Or I should say, like, faintly vibrating. So, okay, so this is no remnant. <laughs> <laughs> I, wait, wouldn't it be glowing? Because it would be more like stable. It, it's, it, it's like a mix. Mm. It's, not, it's not vibrating like it was with the remnant. Can I use it as yes. a different mind? <laughs> Is that what you were wondering, Will? What? Is that what you were wondering, Will? What? Well, let's continue no. before we go in context, okay? Uh, so your sword is just kind of faintly warning you. Do you. Is there any chance at all, Gary, you can talk him down? I I haven't cast a compelled duel yet, by the way. Uh, <laughs> uh, fine, I'll, I, I will uh, commune with the wolves. Uh because they haven't responded to anything. They've, they've just heard. What? They've just been listening, right? <laughs> um, hmm. <laughs> How can I not be an idiot and make <laughs> these wolves want to want to try to do anything stupid? Uh, I'll, I... Oh, fuck. <sighs> Alright, I'll ask this. When when did you when did you find this griffin here, in a commanding voice? Because I don't want to yell anymore. I have a guest downstairs. That's fine. Just a few minutes ago, the wolf kind of snarls back. I can't really do a growl, but he kind he kind of growls that back to you. Hmm. The man that I am, I cannot let this majestic creature go to such waste at the hands, at the paws of you. Well, the circle of life isn't here to be broken. 
this is our dinner. You go on our turf and demand it, you better be ready to fight. Is there a deal we could make to possibly change your mind? That bird over there that you got, that'd be a fine substitute. Whoa, whoa, whoa. No, you, <laughs> can't, no, hear you can't hear that. <laughs> you don't know what the fuck's going on. Shut the fuck up. That bird over there is just as much as a brother as that wolf to your left is to you. <laughs> we will not be making and such trade. if you value this griffin, you're gonna make the trade. <clears throat> I uh, turned to Azriel. Uh, do you want to save this, griffin? Yeah. Cool. I... I turn. I uh, can can Nornik and Wraith see the Griffin now? Uh, yeah, they are now done with the procedure. So okay. if they'd like to do anything after. Uh, I I turn back to them and ask, would you two like to help rescue this Griffin? Oh, absolutely. Okay. Well. Well, what's what's <sighs> happening right now, Gary? What's happening? Here, if, here, I'll, I'll I'll approach Gary a little closer so he can, he can talk to me. Well, this is a whisper now. The wolves cannot hear. <laughs> Um, right? Can I say that? Yes, you're a whisperer. Okay. These wolves do not want to back down from this griffin. They're going to either fight for it, or uh -huh. they want Wraith, and I told them no. Can I walk up to Geary and do the same thing? Can I? Okay, like... Geary, hear me out. Would you also like to approach Wraith? What if we set up... Uh, I'll approach. I can't hear you well. What, what if we, what if we bait? Like, like we, we use, we use Wraith as bait? So it's like, we can lure I'm the wolf into... away. Wait, what about the fox? What about the fake fox? Or has it been too long? It's, it's been too long. Gone. But I, I, wait, no, wait, Bert, I want to there. double check. Yeah, it, has, it, no, it, it only lasts a minute. Long. It hasn't, it hasn't been a full minute, but it's kind of like, oh, it hasn't? It's, it's about to fade out. Uh, Bertie, can I ask something? The, the, the leather, fox. whatever the thing I use to make it, when the illusion runs out, I get it. Do I lose it or do I get it back? No, no you, you, you get, get it back. back. You get it back. Okay, that's what I thought. Because I, I could just recast it, basically. But... Why the fuck do I Is it a cantrip? Feathers? It's, yeah, it's, you, uh, can, it's a cantrip. you can refresh the illusion if you like. Can you, can you spawn in something, like, bigger? No. It has well, to be see, one tile by one tile. Look, this is the whole thing. Make a baby griffin! These guys... <gasps> <laughs> Make a baby griffin to make them get the baby griffin. They already the saw it. They already saw it and they didn't like it. So I'm assuming. No, that they, they saw what? you. No. They saw you. They wanted to well, eat I know. you. Well, no, no, remember, no. Luke's character no earlier. What? No, earlier this is not a the, fox. When I spawned the fox. This is, this is not, not the same fox. No, no, these, these are wolves. These are wolves. These are wolves. The what? fox was killed by know. them. You heard a whimper no, in the distance. Yes, we do. We heard a whimper in the distance. Kind of thought it was just their pack, honestly. <laughs> All right, okay. I'm, I'm gonna, yeah, I gotta, I'm gonna, I'm gotta I'm gonna ask you. Bit. Okay. You're gonna metagame. Should I metagame? Is everyone okay? No, nah, don't metagame. No, okay. Then we'll don't continue. Um, okay. Uh, after seeing Azriel ask Giri a question, I walk up to them and say, "Hey, what'd you tell them?" They want Wraith as food. Oh. I'm saying we use I, Wraith I as clap my hands. I clap Wait, my hands excited. Does the, does the Griffin, does the Griffin want Geary, or not Geary, Wraith as food, or is it the wolves? Wolves. I have an idea. I have an idea. What's your idea, what Gary? What's that idea? <clears throat> Wraith, if you're okay with this, we throw you out in front, and as the first wolf... <laughs> no, 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 listen. And as the first wolf goes to... Uh, Do we to, have the rope? To attack you, I cast Compel Do on it. Oh, I can, I can tie no. up we tie Wraith. Wraith we throw loosely. Ruth. Yeah. No, I say we throw Wraith out there and then yank him back. Oh, you know, no, 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 okay. no, that's a bad idea. No, 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 no. Listen, 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 listen. We throw him out there as the first one. As the first one. Not really. <laughs> nah, I'm sorry. Overall, overall as the... you have the end save. You have uh, the end save. Uh, as, as, the, as, as the first wolf gets near, um, <clears throat> I'll cast Compelled Duel on it and I'll just. Fight that motherfucker! I'll well, be what is shit. compelled duel again? What does it compelled, do? Compelled duel is literally duel from Dota. Okay, so it it forces them to fight you. Yes. Okay. Well, wait, wait, wait! But does, does the Griffin know we're gonna save him? He okay. So the Griffin, the Griffin is a little confused right now. I'll be very honest. Um, Why is he confused? 
I may have misworded a few things, but if we save him, look, if we if we just how do you know how do you know if we duel the wolves, the let griffin him do the talking? Yeah, how if do we know the griffin? I trust him over you. I'm if not you gonna lie. If you didn't notice, there's an arrow in the griffin's wing. It cannot fly, and it obviously hasn't run away yet. Okay. I know. Um... Look, I, uh, I'm compassionate and protecting. This? I think we should save this thing. How about this? How about this? I will pull out my book and I will write down that I I will I will agree to uh, Giri's plan, and but I'm gonna change it up a little. And while I do want him to use dual, I'm going to protect myself with uh, warding wind. That is the 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 the, the compromise. Well, okay, go for it. Um... All right. Do I have to roll initiation for that or no? No, this is we're not fighting yet. Yeah, beforehand, before we start. So, Wraith, you agree, right, to this plan? Yeah, yeah, I agree. All right, I'm gonna I'm, use... gonna I'm gonna cast enhance ability on you. On me or uh... on Wraith? Okay. What is enhance abilities? That just uh, I get to in. choose between five different uh, or six different no yeah five five different things that I want to boost you with like. Um, temporary hit points or carrying temporary capacity. Like balls. Okay. okay. So, so do, gonna... that, do that real quick and I'll act out our little plan here. Yeah. So <laughs> I'm going to cast Enhance Ability on Wraith. Yeah. So you gain extra six hit points. Okay. Perfect. Do I have to add that or no? Do I have to add that or just, yeah, just take care of that? I'm pretty sure you can... Yeah, okay, so click on your just, HP. Just, if you well, take no, no, damage, no, 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 just minus temp. 6 damage. No, 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 there's a literal temp HP thing. Oh, right? and then there's, I set the oh, yeah, your name, yeah. add the temp HP to 6. Okay. Um, so, Birdie, are we good? Did you cast uh, your protection okay. thing on you? Uh, oh, no, so no, that, that's did, what did I asked. Did you want to refresh your illusion? Did you want to refresh your illusion? Probably not. I'm just going to... Okay. Uh, oh, I'm probably just going to use warding. Wait, well, uh, I'm just gonna use wording on myself. Right? And I, I, as Nornik buffs Wraith, and as Wraith pops down a field of wind around him, do you want to walk out towards the wolves? What I'll do sure. instead is no. I was gonna, I was gonna pick him up. Oh. Like, <laughs> not you can't pick me up, dude. This wind actually. Oh, I can't. Strong. You could probably, yeah, you could, probably, you, yeah. you could pick him up, but it'd be kind of like you're. You see, little you little clumsy. To, you have to like close your right eye as you pick him up to not get hit <laughs> in your eye. I pick him up and look at the wolves and say, "You have your deal. A bird for a bird." Right. <laughs> Toss him out like ten feet or twenty feet in front to like so ten feet in front of the wolves. So you, you I just a uh, heads up. It's twenty miles per hour wind. Yeah, I know. Okay. So the wolf, the wolves kind of stare at you all and just say. What games are you playing? None. I value the life of this beast more than the other. Take it. It's yours. Wow. <laughs> he kind of like twists his head at Wraith, trying to figure out what the hell's going on around him. And what's with the wind? Have you not ever seen wind in a fucking Antarctic region? You're a wolf, <laughs> goddammit. <laughs> really slaving. The wolf's kind of like uh, the other. The other wolf. All well, this wolf kind of moves to block the griffin from the rest. This wolf kind of approaches, and they start circling. Luke. Who's Luke? And <laughs> uh, very poorly. Before before I act. Uh, <clears throat> I uh I look at Azriel and uh I yell just uh, this is to get them away from the this the whole plan was to get them away from their fucking griffin. Um it was still the one close, but he'll probably end up coming in. Uh I could be completely wrong, but I look at Azriel and I shout or I don't shout and I kind of not wink but give him a sign. And as I do that, I cast Compelled Duel as I run my thumb across my throat looking at the wolf on the upper side, on the right side of Wraith. Okay. He's 30 feet away from me. Everyone go ahead and roll initiative. Fuck. Initiative! Right, Woo! 
Oh, I'll take it. Oh. I'll take it. Chris, if you're going first, regardless, you're going. you are. Uh, you are the six. Even, no one else can join this wow. call. Oh, I rolled a seven. I rolled thought you were instilled like one of the other calls. Okay, so. I don't think uh, I should be com too scared. Compel, compel, will Compelled Duel make the wolf be in melee range, Brody? Uh, the wolf will have to walk up to you. Okay, uh, at this point, he is... Can't, since, have we technically started combat yet, or are we just still just, like, rolling? Because I want to... Uh, jo combat has not necessarily started, but Joseph has the first action combat when it does start. Okay. Um, I'm gonna quick, uh, I whisper to Geary, hey, I'm gonna go try and heal that griffin to get him fight for us. You down with that plan? Make sure you speak to him first. He's not very friendly right now. Will do. So, can I roll stealth to go into uh, stealth? Go ahead. Alrighty, stealth is down here. Oh, my God. <laughs> well, the one wolf doesn't see him, that's for sure. Pretty sure they're all focused on... Uh, Right. They're probably sort of salt meat. So would they, would they be at disadvantage? Okay. okay. Sorry, I, I don't mean to ask questions. Yeah, you're, you're fine, you're fine. I'm just setting up the fight. So, Ethan, uh, so Joseph, would you like to compass, cast Compelled Duel? It has already been cast, cast, yeah. Okay. So let me just real quick read the full spell to make sure I don't have to do anything. And I, and I yell out, no one hit him, he's mine! <laughs> in a very loud intimidating voice as to freak the wolf out because he gets drawn towards me like Lich's fucking E <laughs> uh, not bad not bad <laughs> can I give custom effects for my abilities really random question uh, what do you mean by that? like can I can I say uh, as a cast compelled duel uh Icy chain or like chains seem to spill out from my body and attach to the enemy. Uh, it's it. not, yes, but not in the exact same way because that it's different. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The spells, yeah. Are, the spells you're thinking of is completely yeah, completely different. different. I just, I'm just like giving an example. Birdie, quick question. Hmm. Meta gaming, I guess. Um, for ice knife, it says it takes a drop of water or piece of ice. This is perfect area for it. Yeah. <laughs> however, yes. however, um, once like let's say we leave this area, if I use the knife, do I keep the water like after I use it, or is, the, is it, this? It's uh... more of it's like you throw the knife, and it could be like an explosion, and the explosion from the knife spreads water everywhere. So then I could just re get that water. Okay. I was just yeah. curious if I. It's, it, it's if not I... like creating a shit ton of water, but it does increase the amount of water by a tiny bit. Okay. Shout uh, out. We're really in a perfect place for Ice Knife, boys. <laughs> you better be casting that and only that. Because isn't it a guaranteed hit? No, it, so... it, it, the whole thing is it's a guaranteed hit. Or not but a guaranteed the, hit. The it's explosion. just a hit. And then the explosion is a deck save. So Joseph, as you compel the wolf, the wolf, the wolf feels drawn and starts walking over towards you, compelled to your fight. You get, he kind of, as he approaches, he lets out a bite at you. Does a six hit? No, <laughs> not even close. Are you sure, he Joseph? Kind of, he he sure? kind of like bites the air. All, all you hear is just a. As, as his dog just clap his ass cheeks. <laughs> his dog's throwing it back. <laughs> All right. Uh, okay. Okay. Uh, and I don't think you can do anything else on your turn. Well, I can hit, can I? Because he's. Can I not swing? Uh. Um. Oh, you know what? You're right. I might not be able that... to. Well, no, because I no, because I cast compelled duel before rolling initiative. Here's the whole thing about it. It's kind of like 
that was my initi- that was my turn for initiative. That, it's kind of like because you're the one initiative. I'm I'm allowing you to go first. Or okay. Okay. Of that's fine. That's fine. It's mm-hmm. just more of it's still gonna take your action. Saying you get an action yeah. and another action immediately is kind. I, of I was just wondering if I can get a free schmack on his boy. <laughs> no, I don't, I don't. I don't think you can. Uh, it is Ethan's turn. What? No, it's Actually, Luke. no it is it Luke's. Yeah, it, it is Luke's. So, okay, so we're definitely fighting these guys. Um, by any chance, can I... Mm, never mind, never mind. Oh, you know, I kind of have an idea. I'm just curious. So, Birdie, let's say... And I'm not going to. I'm just curious. Scorching Ray, it kind of just shoots this ray of fire. If I were to shoot all three across the ground in front of me, would I just the fucking uh, ice in half like can i even do that are oh, you trying to like br- right now you're on a landmass oh okay so it's, it's you not off, sheet of you ice. off the ice onto a land yeah we're on rock you can see that we're on a rock now. Some very rocky ice it's like we went up an icy beach gotcha gotcha okay then uh the, 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 trees kind of gives it away where the trees? I guess there's one over there, but I think that was a tree actually. Those plants <laughs> um, next to the griffin. Oh, I thought those are cracks or like ice shards. Hey, you're an idiot. This map's not I exactly perfect see. for what I'm trying to show. I, mean, I, I can't really see. Bit. It's on my like smaller monitor. Okay, so, yeah, uh, Wraith, your turn. Okay. Um. I mean, we're killing the dong, so. Uh, can I just take a sheet, like a piece of ice from the ground, turn it into an ice knife, and throw it at the dog to my left? Or the wolf to my left? Uh, so throw an ice knife at the wolf to your left, go ahead. Uh, level one ice knife, not level two. Mm-hmm. Go ahead. Finally. So you... Wow. You did your damage roll, right? That, that was, was a hit. hit. That was hit. Isn't the damage base? That was damage. Uh, okay. So you did... Okay, so you did 9 damage. Okay. So as, as you... Tie, as part of the snow from the ground slowly rises up into the shape of a knife, it flies towards the wolf to your left wraith, hit, hitting him in the chest, kind of making him stumble to the ground. As blood starts kind of, per like pussing out from it. So the there was no explosion. Damn. He does he does roll over and dislodge the knife from himself though. Okay. He actually made the deck saving throw. What's that? <laughs> A wolf? Oh my goodness! Fuck that! Okay. <laughs> One and now, Ethan's turn. What would you like to do? Um, I'm going to attempt to sneak up and around Geary and Wraith closer to the Griffin. So as as you're walking, you keep going, you keep going. And uh, Brody, as I speak with animals is still active, I would like to hear some commentary from the what nose kid. Does a twelve hit? Oh, this is on me. So, as you walk past, the wolf notices your approach, but kind of... Wait, which wolf? Which wolf? This isn't you. you. Oh. Oh. This isn't you, though. I I, I know. The wolf kind of gives a quick snap to you, even as you leave its range, but it completely misses. Wait, what are you... Wait, he can't... No, he can't... He literally cannot try. No, he can. He can? It's just with disadvantage if he tries to attack someone else. Oh, is it actually? Okay, okay. My bad. And this is a uh, opportunity attack, because Ethan is moving it past him. So, Ethan, you still have... Still have my actions. How far did I move? You you can move about... Well, I know I can move 25 here. feet. Okay. I just want to make sure. You probably move like... Yeah, yeah, I think you move about there. Okay. Um, 
and, you know, assuming that, you know, I just got nipped at. I'm assuming my stealth check didn't work. Um, <laughs> I'm going to, uh, first of all, I'm going to, actually, no. What are you doing? I'm just going to do nothing. Okay. Uh... Azrael is here to go. What would you like to do? Well, I have two choices here. I can try to run up and heal the griffin, but I feel like the griffin doesn't trust me, so I'm not doing that. My choice? Fucking, fucking metagamer. <laughs> just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just using detective reasoning. Cause you well, it's, it's, it's pin. It's It was pinched in a corner, and it has an arrow in its fucking wing. Of course it doesn't trust you right now. Yeah, okay. Anyway. I'm gonna Eldritch Blast the furthest wolf. Go ahead and roll. Hit. <laughs> Don't miss and hit 19. The or, tw or 21. Oh, thank god. Twenty-one. That does indeed hit. Twelve damage. Sheesh. Uh, okay. So, as you start tr charging up an Eldritch Blast from behind Geary, you launch it at the wolf farthest away from you, hitting it directly in the head, kind of taking away a chunk of it, the center of its forehead. Wow. It is, is now, still alive? It is now dead. Murder! Murder! Okay, so that means that the wolves each have 12 health. Or less. Yeah. Got 10. Okay. So that means my attack basically so... killed it, so... <laughs> Uh, the other wolf kind of starts approaching you, Luke, and as it gets up to you, it kind of just, it bites the air, but it, like, kind of does, like, backs away at the exact same time. Is that, like, an effect of my, is that, like, the effect of my wind, or no? He rolled a nat one. <laughs> oh. <laughs> so the, the wolf kind of tries to attack but is too scared to approach and just kind of attacks nothing <laughs> I thought even like he was too scared of like the wind that was like some hidden feature I didn't know I was like ah oh, cool cool <laughs> wind scares dogs <laughs> <laughs> maybe it like pushed him back and towards the end of, you start seeing the griffin stumble oh, away from you all Guess. Do you want me to catch? Do you want to? Do you want me to go like catch up to him, Gary? To the guaf. Well, your 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 turn yes, isn't for a I know, I know. If you could, yes. Okay, so Gary, it is your turn. What would you like to do? I'm gonna smack this motherfucker. Go ahead. Oh, does an eight hit? <laughs> no, an eight does not hit. <laughs> do you have any bonus actions? I can unarm strike it. That's a that's a bonus action, right? Can you? Uh, <clears throat> oh, I can cast uh, ins I can cast ensnaring strike. <laughs> yeah, no, you can't unarm strike it. Oh, darn it. Okay, dude. Yeah, my I'll, just, I'll strike just I'll just go. zero damage. I don't know why. You're a bird. Okay, <laughs> so you kind of like try to swing your flail on it, and it kind of like darts back for a second, but then reapproaches. Can I can I speak out to the Griffin after that, or not? Am I done? Uh, you can actually... Doesn't it... Wait. Speak with animals. You, you can yeah. say something to the griffin as it's running away. <clears throat> Alright, I uh, say, wait! We are trying to help you! We can heal you! Uh, as you say this, the wolf kind of bites at your leg does a 20 hit it does not so the the wolf kind of like grabs a piece of your armor and tries to pull back but it's kind of, you, you're able to swat it away before it actually can do anything 
What the fuck hits Joseph? Uh, 21 and above. <laughs> Is that base? <laughs> no. Um, he's got he's got an advantage because of the armor I gave him from the. Yeah, he, he gave me a really good armor. <laughs> now I'm looking for a tower shield. Oh my god. Uh. Okay, Wraith, it is your turn. Uh, I'll just cast Firebolts on the on the. Actually, uh, uh, can I uh, meta game something real quick? I I was reading my unarmed strength because I, I was kind of curious why it said it. it had zero damage, but it says that on a hit, an unarmed strike deals bludgeoning damage equal to one plus your strength modifier. So is. Uh, your no, wait, hold up. No, you. Yeah. First of all, why the fuck does it say unarmed strike? You should have talents, because you're fucking. No, he doesn't. He doesn't he have it. Why? He There's should. No wings and toes. He doesn't have wings. He doesn't have wings. He's no, like, no, no. I can't fly. He's a human. Uh, yeah, no, with a no, bird that doesn't matter. You should still have talents, no. shouldn't he not? Uh, Kenkus do not he, have he, talents. Kenkus. They're, they're crows they're without. Different, yeah, they're crows. Yeah. Different breed. Okay. It's built different. Well. He is literally no different, bro. So what, what would you like to? What would you like to do? Okay, no, I was just double checking. It, that's my damage, it's just based on my strength. Yeah. So your unarmed strike is more of like, do you want to smash just... someone but not do anything? Okay. Um. Then I'll pull out my scimitar and see if I can behead the thing. <laughs> uh... <laughs> Be a little ruthless. <laughs> oh, hit. <laughs> Shit. No <laughs> way. So as, as you pull out the scimitar, you kind of swing, and the wolf. You see him kind of like pop up a little bit and get pushed back by your wind. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> uh, metagaming, shouldn't he get moved back as <laughs> quick? <laughs> Uh, Nornik, it's your turn. What would you like to do? I would like to dash after the Griffin. So that do you want to use? Do you want to move and dash? You just go as far as I possibly can. Do you want to? You should cast speak with animals as well. <laughs> no, you can't. Actually, no, you can't because you dash. <laughs> I just imagine a dwarf like charging up like a fucking superhero and just. <laughs> sure, a little pop. I mean, okay. if he's gonna chase, I'm not gonna chase, even though I had a better chase potential. So, that is dashing is uh, action? Or? What's it called? So, I yeah, uh, let's have a bonus action you wanna use, that's where you're ending. Is that okay, or did you wanna be somewhere else? Um, I'd like to be. How far can I go with a dash? That's. I put you at the very farthest. Very farthest, okay. Um, yeah, I'll stay there, that's fine. Okay. Uh, Azrael, it is your turn. What would you like to do? Well, I mean, I'll just fucking Eldritch Blast the fucking fucker in front of Wraith. Go ahead. You, oh, never mind, never mind. Thirteen. A thirteen. Did you say hits? I didn't hear you. Mm -hmm. It does. Okay. Nine. <laughs> Viscerated this thing, Jesus. I'm upset. Conjuring I want up, my Griffin. Conjuring up another Eldritch Blast. You target it towards the chest of the wolf and miss a tiny bit, hitting its right front leg, essentially severing it and making the wolf stumble a tiny bit. It's not dead? Is this an alpha? It could be, actually. Did I compel do the wrong one? <laughs> <laughs> Fuck? Mm, failure. Uh, the wolf, upon getting attacked, rushes you, Will. Oh no. My damage does not run. Please don't fail me. <laughs> and kind of try, tries to bite you. He, he goes in for a bite, but kind of leans too far right and starts falling a tiny bit as he can't catch himself with his stub. Cool. Then 
The griffin, upon seeing a tiny dwarf appear to its side, kind of starts... He goes on a defensive guard and starts backing away so his back's against the wall. Geary, it is your turn. What would you like to do? Uh, I smack. Go ahead and smack. Uh, was a 10 hit? No. You smack. Oh it. my god. <laughs> Look, okay. Do I want to cast Ensnaring Strike just so I can hit this fucker? No, it does not. So the wolf again tries to nip at you, but fails. This is like a this is like a donut duel, but we both have evasion. <laughs> Raith, what would you like to do? Yeah, oh, I already took it off. Fuck, I was trying something different. Nah, it's gonna backfire. All right, uh, I'll cast Magic Missile two on each. And level one magic missile. A... Wait. What? Hmm? No, you have level one's three. Oh, yeah, and shit, level one's three. Uh, I'll, I'll put two on Joseph's and one on the one on Will. That's fine. Okay. My bad. So I I'm roll a... three times? Go, go ahead, yeah, roll three times. This one. Three. Okay. So the first two are gonna be the first two, and the fourth is gonna or the third is gonna be the one. Yep. So as these darts conjure, two darts hit the butt of the wolf, lo looking towards Joseph, kind of making it yip in surprise, but not go down. The compel and... duel, by the way, is now uh, broken. Okay. The wolf fighting Asriel gets a dart lodged in the back of its head, and after impact, kind of just falls over. <laughs> You're welcome, Will. <laughs> you know what's That's my first kill. It's my first kill. I'm yet to kill anything. In this uh, damn game. Uh, Ethan, fuck off. Uh, Asriel, it's your turn. What would you like to do? Uh, <clears throat> I would like to walk up to it, P pull my, uh, my packed weapon out of the ether and slash at it. I'm going to go ahead and roll a hit. Let's go. Fuck! <laughs> I mean, you, you you pull you pull out your you pull out your long sword, but as you reach out to grab it, instead of grabbing the hilt of the blade, you kind of accidentally grab the blade, and upon pricking yourself, you kind of like let go of it, and the weapon hits the floor, and you have to spend your action repicking it. Up. <laughs> wow! I thought you rolled something. Is it my turn? Oh, it's, I guess it's the uh, I guess it's Ethan and the Griffin's turn, huh? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Ethan, what would you like to do? So funny. I'd like to cast Animal fucking Friendship gets on a the Griffin. Packed weapon. It's supposed mm. to be fucking cool. Fucking Go grabs ahead. it because I haven't fucking practiced with the fucking packed weapon. God fucking damn it! Uh, I had so many yeah, fucking so cool things planned for you. This one doesn't like actually have like a thing. Shit, so, uh, uh, I'll just so it's Animal Friendship. Mm -hmm. 14 wisdom. Griffin's very dumb. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so you casted it, right? Yes. So uh, the cast is a success. The All Griffin right. no longer sees you as a threat. You're going to have to explain to it. <laughs> do, you, do you want to approach it at all? Um, the Griffin will no longer attack you. Yeah, at least I'll, I'll get I'll group. get in between it and the rest of the group, or but like closer to the Griffin. Yeah. Okay. And so it is now the the Griffin is kind of just sat there now, a little okay with staying where it is. Uh, Joseph, it's your turn. What would you like to do? Schmecker, <laughs> schmecker, schmecker. Go ahead and try to schmack. 
Oh, it looks like it goes on an 18, but it's an 8! <laughs> you again try to smack and... Oh my god, my rolls are... I need to get real die. I don't like this fucking internet die, dude. It's so bad. Dude, he'd cheat this shit. He'd you just want to cheat. Shit. No, I want to <laughs> real die. Uh, after, after seeing the opening with Asriel dropping his blade, the wolf attempts to attack you... Can I can I do a reaction attack? Uh, it's not moving. Does a oh, but it's, ten... going, it's turning away from me. It's turning away from you, but an opportunity attack is when it moves from five feet to a wo- past five feet. Oh like, damn it! it. Inside the retreat. Okay. So oh, we'll, okay. We'll, does a ten hit? Ten hit me? No. Okay. So the wolf kind of like turned and again tries to knit, but doesn't want to get too close, as he is still scared of your weapon. Wait, did uh, I ever send you what I want? Never mind. I'll, I'll talk to you later about it. Maurice, it's your turn. What would you like to do? Mm, I mean, I guess I'll just cast a fire, uh, fire bolts on it. Is that a cantrip? Okay. Yeah. Go ahead and roll it. Why the fuck so many strong cantrips? <laughs> it's a wizard. Mm, Is yeah. it? Oh. oh, I got pretty Doesn't lucky hit. Go ahead and roll damage. Fire bolt. You guys are just softening up for me. Thanks, guys. <laughs> I appreciate it. So you launch a fireball at the wolf. This lights part of its... Uh, you, you hit it towards its rear end, because you're trying to avoid hitting either Azriel or Giri. And you light tiny part of its fur on fire, which does quickly go out due to the cold in the area, but you do take part of its tail off with the firebolt. Pop. It is now... Uh, Will's turn is void, because... Yes. <laughs> Actually, no, it's... Yeah, we're gonna go Azrael, it's your turn. I know it's technically Ethan's, but... Mm-hmm. Wait, didn't... He's in a different, he's in didn't... A different world right now. Yeah, I'm, I'm just kind of like... <laughs> Can I stab the... him with my fucking sword? Yes, you can. Don't miss. <laughs> nine, and he fucking missed. Nine, <laughs> nine, nine. Not, not taking this fight entirely seriously, you kind of <laughs> get your sword, and with a with a good old huzzah, you kind of thrust your sword, but miss. Dude, what a flame! <clears throat> hey, can you turn off your wind? Your wind's kind of distracting me there. Uh... <laughs> Don't turn the fucking flame. Azrael, Azrael, do you want to talk? I'm having the same problem. <laughs> I, 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 isn't it weird that whenever we're around him, that like I was hitting my fucking sure. shots, dude. I was hitting I my, my, my shots. Problem. I completely agree. We should have let like... the wolves eat him. <laughs> you know, let's, let's no, back up. your turn. What would you like to do? Wait, it's my turn. Yes. Okay. It is now your world. And you could just try to sue them. You don't have to do that much. Yeah, I'd like to cast um, Speak with Animals. Speak with Animals. Go ahead. Yeah. Okay, and what would you like to say? Like, hey there, Griffin. I know my friend Geary got off on the wrong foot with you, but trust me, we're here to help. Go ahead and roll Venture. Animal Handling. Please don't roll a fucking... Uh, I roll, roll it with advantage. Roll it with oh. advantage. Animal Handling... <laughs> Watch a roll lower. Twenty. Oh, oh, never mind. So with this, the Griffin kind of like starts settling down. It, it uh, starts actually laying down, kind of still like putting its wing in an awkward position as to not deepen the wound. Can I? Oh, uh, since I stole my bonus action, right? Yeah, you do have a bonus action. Um... I want to walk up and sit next to the griffin and petting its head. <laughs> what? Okay, so as it's slowing down, you could kind of like pet part of it, but yeah. do keep in mind this thing is massive compared to you. You can't quite reach its head, so you're more of petting its neck. Back to Geary, what would you like to do? I am Shemekka. <laughs> I don't smack her. <laughs> oh my fucking god, guys. Jesus Christ. Uh, to speed things up, Wraith, what would you like to do? <laughs> uh, 
I'll just cast Skimitar. I want to cut off uh, Ted. Cast Skimitar. No, it's oh, Ted. <laughs> cast Skimitar. <laughs> cast Skimitar. Oh, my God. Oh, yeah. Watch him roll, like, no damage. Okay. It's not dead. So, <laughs> after, after Azrael's amazing display of bravery <laughs> with his attack, you kind, of, you kind of, with your scimitar still kind of out, but in your offhand, put it back into your main hand, and kind of just with one firm swipe, just decapitate the wolf. Oh, thank fuck. Y'all can't roll for shit. <laughs> Apparently not. All right. After and after that, I uh, I, I dash towards uh, Nornik and the Griffin. The fight is over, so no dashing is required. Now we're back to non-combat. <laughs> the music is gone. Oh, there's music. Fuck. Did you have it muted? I had to. I had the bot down because Dylan was playing. <laughs> Dylan was playing. Get that. All right. Now he's streaming. What is recording? Oh my god. <laughs> Almost <Joseph. said> it. <laughs> Almost. <said it. laughs> so. Um, as as I see the group approaching, I I wave my hand towards them to slow down. And I can, it can it can still talk to me. Remember? Can oh, yeah. yes. Ten minutes has not passed. You can you can still understand it, and you can, but it's now talking. I'm just saying to you guys to slow the fuck down. Be careful. Stay far back. So it doesn't get aggro because it trusts stay me. Low. It doesn't trust you guys. Stay low. Stay, stay frosty. <laughs> um. Give it a Snickers. Okay. Um, Dude, well, that was kind of good. I, I'm i going to ask the griffin if it's okay with me healing it. But that would require me pulling out the arrow first. Or snapping it. I say snap it first. Just, right, oh, snap new it. music. This is Skyrim music. Probably. I just pulled up Icy Thing. Don't worry about it. So the griffin kind of looks down towards you and just gives you a firm nod and kind of prostrates its wing. All right, low enough so you can reach it. This is gonna hurt, but I promise I'll heal it immediately, so it won't hurt for long. Get ready. I proceed to snap off the part, one of the the back of the arrow, and pull it through the front towards myself. Go ahead and, and roll a medicine check. You murder him by accident with a net one. Okay. And at the same time, I cast Cure Wounds. Okay. The bird kind of lets out a tiny chirp. But Chicken. besides that, is fine. Chicken and how much did you heal it for? I uh, have yet to roll. Uh, three. So, oh, actually, seven. Because I have to pause for it. Okay. Um, so the, the griffin now being able to, the griffin stands up and starts kind of flapping its wings. And then after that, just puts them by its side. Uh, I will come in and say, griffin, I'm very sorry for the confusion I gave you earlier. And uh, as I do that, I give it three more health to give it ten health. <laughs> okay. Hey, I can do that too now, actually. Hold up. <laughs> I'm probably going to heal the griffin. Hold up. Hold up. You can literally only heal five. What are you doing? Well, No, I have lay on hands. I know, I'm you can only think, heal five right now. They still be, wouldn't he technically still be aggro against him? Wouldn't, no, Joseph would have to run or uh, roll a uh, whatever roll. No, would I? Because he's still... The griffin's only he, friends with me, not aggro the griffin, with you. The griffin's friends with you, but by proxy, he's not hostile, but he's not exactly friendly with them. Yeah. The healing is kind of a show of friendship. I'll heal. So the griffin doesn't necessarily trust them, but is accepting the offering. I'll heal five. You're wasting all your healing? No, I, I have fucking five uses. Or oh, wait. Fuck, never mind. Wait, what? <laughs> yes? No, wait. Five is... Uh, 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 will. Wait, what, 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 what spell are you talking about? Which yeah, okay. Lay on hands, pool. Oh, Fuck. oh that's my uh, pool. Never mind. Yeah. Dum dum. Can I heal him? What a dum dum. Can I heal him <laughs> one to show I'm friendly? Uh, you can heal him one. I healed it's him. Like, it's like giving someone an Advil. <laughs> <laughs> Did 
really, <laughs> Joseph really did three kill Joseph. It really did really kill Griffin. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Fall him starts to come out of the Griffin's mouth because of the overhealing. <laughs> He's been ubercharged. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So, Angry lady, calm down. Sorry. Apollo, what would you guys like to do now that they dressed Griffin? At least loosely uh, trust all of you. Okay, uh, Damn, as, like as the only two who can actually talk to her now, Ethan and I indulge in conversation. Um, Make him my pet. Sex what? slave. <laughs> no. Uh, okay, I'm, say... I'm, gonna a- I'm gonna ask the griffin what its tail is. Uh, and how did it end up in the situation that it was. Oh, what, oh tail is in story. Yes. Oh. Come on, you're not metagaming enough, Joseph. I thought you meant tail as in, like, it's actual tail. I was like, are you dumb as fuck? It's a lion's <laughs> tail. No, I thought it was a snake tail. I was like, what? I thought, well, not uh, like the tail of a snake. The tail is a snake. You're thinking of a chimera. That's right. Let's go, Ethan. Fuck you. Can't hit chimera. shot from two feet away. Chimera ants, man. Okay, you yeah, say that, like, I... any... I'm gonna make him come... Like a compilation of after of all your fails, just to send to you and play on repeat. Oh, I am wow. down with that. It's kind of really it's gonna, it's just gonna be, it's just gonna be a compilation of him going uh or oh fuck. Yeah, no, it'll be him being like, "Hey, you guys suck," and then I'll play every single time after how many times he's failed, just to show how much of a loser like, you are. Dun, 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 well, dun, 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 do you know who shot you? No, I was just flying by. Ask if he's seen the box. <laughs> uh, by chance, have you seen a little fox skimper around here? Not in recent memory. <gasps> it's still alive. It's alive, boy. It's alive. It's still alive. <laughs> Geary, Geary does a poggers face and then quickly fades away. He's back to normal. Um, let's see. <laughs> Alright, now we fight Mr. the Griffin. Mr. Griffin, I, I, Mr. Griffin asks you a question of just where are you headed? We are on venture from a fellow we know from a town across the water. We're headed to Saul's vault if you really want to know. The bird kind of just thinks hard. It doesn't reveal if it comes up with anything. Do you have a home or a nest or anywhere to stay? Yes, I I can situate myself. <laughs> can you situate for adventure? <laughs> <laughs> that wasn't a real question. That was not a real question. Um... <clears throat> Oh yeah, PS Luke and Will, remember you can't understand any of this? Yeah, no, yeah, no, no, no. game, Luke. Mm, well, what did I do? You're go I know you're going to metagame. No, I'm just okay, it's fine. You. Okay. Listen, I don't have faith in Luke, but I have more faith than that, uh, Ethan. God damn. Wow, I'm really like do you guys really think that little one? <laughs> no. This is this the is Griffin, not the Griffin the Griffin chimes up to you, Geary. Which direction is this? Sal's vault you're headed? I believe it's up north. We were told it's past, uh, somewhere past these ice sheets. I can't come with you the entire way, but I, I can try to repay my debt a little bit. Become our and- pet. And, and upon <laughs> upon that, as Ethan's kind of addressing Azriel and the race, the Griffin kind of grabs Ethan by the back of the neck with its beak and kind of <laughs> tosses it onto his back. <laughs> that's adorable. Okay. Um, I think that's super cute. <laughs> okay, oh, should I? Ask that would be horrifying. Weird. What do you mean? Is yeah, is there any scary. way? To I'm two years old. I think it's cute. Is there any way to tame the Griffin? <laughs> Permanently, not with what you have. If you were like a druid Fuck. or something, different story. But... Fuck! Why can't you be a druid? 
You had to be a bard. You had to fuck like everything, huh? And, 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 and I seduce him. <laughs> you cannot seduce the Griffin. No. Oh, that baby. Uh, so there's what nothing we could do to have him on our side permanently. There's, there's nothing there's we can do. Spells to deal with it. Bro, you tell me I can't stick my rock hard rock cock in this group. <laughs> what you have, you can't tame it. Damn it. Hmm. I'd love to have a cool griffin to be with us on the rest of this journey. That'd be so cool. I wonder if I had uh, a level two spells that could have done that. Man. That would have been so wait, funny if I didn't have uh, Mr. Mr. spell to tame it. Uh, there are spells, but it's a lot like classes. So I know uh, druids are able to have uh, beasts. Rangers are able to have beasts. There's just a lot of stuff where if it's more than a certain amount of time, like you could tame beasts for like hours, mm -hmm. but like if you want a beast permanently, that's a much different story. How would you get that? How would you acquire like that? It, there's a, there's different classes that do it, but it's mainly just ranger and druid. Druid is a... Um, I think you have a link with your animal, and Ranger's oh. more of just like a hunting partner. Okay, okay. Damn it, I kind of hit a druid now. Whatever, uh, it doesn't matter. Uh, Mr. Griffin, would you mind, uh, obviously, you're okay with it now, but uh, leading us partly the way there as much as you can? Oh, Ranger Beast. Beast <laughs> Master. If you give me directions. Uh, I turn to Azrael and Wraith. Azrael Wraith, do you remember the exact directions to Sal's vault? North. Or no, sorry, blue. <laughs> <laughs> oh, eat tiny now. <laughs> I just want to eat them on the back. <laughs> North. <laughs> I, okay, I turn back to the curve. Yeah. <sighs> For north. what we just know, it's it's north. North. Hey, hey, sorry, do that. Sorry, that was acting up. North. <laughs> it is north. Proceed the beatbox. North. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, Yo, let, let me a beat. Let me, let me beat. Let me beat. Let me... <clears throat> With that, the north. griffin starts flapping its wings, and ascends to about. 80 feet into the air. <laughs> well, so it my guys. Absolutely, it absolutely takes Ethan into the air. I assume we have to be uh, following you. I don't think he can hear you. He can't hear you. He can't hear can you. I <laughs> yell it? Can I absolutely yell it? 80, 80 feet? feet? What the fuck? You can yell 80 feet. No, you fucking yes, you can't. Can. You, dude, you can yell across a football field. That's 100 yards. It's like it's like a football field, so you can yell it, yeah. No, it's not even a football field. Bro, 300 feet. I know, feet. yeah, I know. Okay, I know, I know. Okay, yeah, so I, I yell at the Griffin. I, I, I'm not going to re-say, but you know what I said. Yeah. Uh, The Griffin doesn't respond, but Ethan, would you like to respond? Uh... Listen no. for these sick tunes. There once was a girl named Ragnar the Red. <laughs> oh, no one gets that. I I shall not respond because it wasn't a question for me. You could ask the fucking Griffin. Could, but he didn't respond, and I'm assuming you hear it because I heard it. Fucker. And with that, he kind of just starts flying north. <laughs> Bye, guys. <laughs> uh... <laughs> Hi, so Ethan's no longer in the session. Cool, right, as, I, as I run, I trip and you hear, oh, nibba! Ah! <laughs> okay. So, uh, oh, are we so, ending there? Uh, that is the end of that tiny encounter. Oh, uh, cool. So now we're, okay. now we're exploring. Conti again. Continuing moving north, what pace would you guys like? Wait, wait, before we go, I want to have a conversation with the Griffin mid flight. Uh, go ahead. Okay, right. are you guys gonna leave, or do we have to change call? No, no, no just just don't metagame. Okay, I'm um, gonna go grab my dessert. I'll be back. <laughs> I asked him if he's ever heard anything about a binding ritual. Why would no? I can't exactly cast magic, so there's no point in me learning anything about it. Um. Well, I mean, 
if what do you do in your day to day time? Hunts, make a living. I was wondering because we could really use your help on this adventure if you want to become my pet. You can, I can promise you anything you desire when it comes to food and shelter and entertainment. Look, I've already been humiliated by being needed to be saved. So let me repay this debt and move on. Don't, really don't think, don't think of it as an embarrassment. We did this out of our own hearts. I'm sure, your friend also did it out of his stomach, wanting to kill me. He he is an idiot, I know, but this isn't between you and him. He's only here temporarily. This is between you and I. Wow, you like gay lovers now? <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> yes, I am into bestiality with a beast made out of many beasts. Dude, it's like the Rick and Morty episode where they had that like weird shit with the dragon. <laughs> Uh, Look, I, I appreciate your offer, but I'm happy with my life. And with that, he tries. He does. He stops getting, responding to all further inquiries about I'm getting it. shot by Son arrows and eaten by wolves. Ethan, you really did. You, uh, you really did send that. Uh, Ethan, your warning was very awkward. That could be my pet. <laughs> yeah, he really said pet. Say. You should have said ally. Kitten. <laughs> <laughs> it is part lion. Son of a bitch. Okay, whatever. Brody, can I met a game real quick? If he would have said, can you be my kitten? Would you have said yes to the partnership between us and a grub? Was there anything that I could have done to get him as a pet? No. Out, out of game, as you are, no. As I tried to say about two to three times now. Yeah, I'm You're just not listening. It's like the chair. We got Ethan over here asking magic about magic shit to a griffin. Let's go. I was looking at ritual stuff a couple days ago. And uh -huh. said there was like a binding ritual that the dungeon master could say he like if he wanted the person to have a pet, he could do. But it was like a more of a role play thing. That this person had. doesn't necessarily want to be a pet. Okay. Yeah, he's a he's wild. They're, they're, they're wild. Oh well, and... I'm still friends with them for. It's not. It's not like he's been growing up near humans. He's a legit wild griffin. Okay. So uh, as, as just he like disappears oh, into the magic. air. Would you all like to continue at a medium pace, or would you like to change it up? Let's go um, slow. Medium. No, no, I want to let Ethan be no, on his own. <laughs> Fine. You know what? Actually, as what are your thoughts on this? I would like to continue medium, but you can choose. I wanted to go medium, or meme and go fast and go zoom zoom, and then find another uh, revenant. Zoom. No, please no. I'm I'm all for medium. I don't medium. care where we go. I just kind of want to go slow for memes. Hey Gary. Huh? How do you use the restroom? You are raw. <laughs> this is banter as you all start walking. Away. Oh, I'm 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 I'm, <laughs> I'm just going. Sorry. I, uh... I know the rations are really good. <sighs> I've heard of this notion of. Restroom. Um, <laughs> confusing enough as it is, although I may look look human or whatever race you may associate me with, I do not have to use this restroom. Are you? Do you have a gender? I'm assuming so. Am I wrong? <laughs> is my assumptions wrong? Am I? I'm sorry if I'm misgendering you. <laughs> From what I was told when I was working on a farm, I look like a male. Very large male, to be in fact. A lot of the elves and dwarves were very shocked at my size for my race. So, so you're Come male? On. Yes. Uh, oh, okay. Essentially. Okay. You Come have none on. of that titty shit, right? Uh, what is this titty shit you speak of? <laughs> Uh, tumors on your chest. I start drawing a picture of titties on my book. <laughs> <laughs> oh, uh, no, I do not have those tumors. 
Yeah, whatever those women have back from my hometown. T tumors. <laughs> They'll die. <laughs> now that you tell me, I'm very grateful I do not have these yeah, tumors. Yeah. Uh, dude, does that mean that the next time Gary runs across a woman, he's gonna go, nice tumors? <laughs> like, tries to do a medical uh, procedure to save her from the tumors. As, as, as you all continue your march, can I piss behind a tree real quick? Yeah. One sec, I'll be back. You can continue okay. pissing. And a as the fire is being set up, you all start noticing you're, you're hungry. All three of you. Oh yeah, we need our rations, huh? You're right. How many are we getting rid of? Uh, For now, just one. Okay. Very kind. <sighs> Wait, do I have to do edit character to get rid of it? Uh... You just have to go to equipment, rations, and then minus one. Crap! That is not what that said it looked like. Okay, hold on, I gotta re-add 17 rations. <laughs> <laughs> that, hungry that... man! Hungry <laughs> man! Dude, the way that they fucking, like, have that menu set up... No, 17. Uh, how about you have 17 rations? Now I gotta add seven more. Wait, how the hell does he have that many rations? I only had ten. <laughs> uh, uh, I it's picked a shit ton up from the, uh, the yacht yurt. I uh, gave you guys some, didn't I? Yeah, I gave, I gave, I gave you all, I gave us all ten. You guys should all have plus ten of your rations. So I should have twenty. Have you not been eating? I don't know. I, I haven't touched my rations once, I hope you know. Ah. Uh, he, he, he was taking the charity of other people. Hello. How are you listening here, you little shit? Uh, I'm sorry, I had to run back. Right I had to catch up. Yeah. I, was, I, was wondering... I was pissing Gary, so, I'm sorry. Uh, I didn't mean to leave your side, I love you. Okay. Every, everyone, everyone, Doc around. This concept of love is new to me. Ethan, yeah. uh, Ethan, it's here? immense friendship. Well, I love you too, Ethan, then. You here? Bye. No. Ethan is not talking because he's metagaming. <laughs> <laughs> okay. No, the answer is he isn't metagaming. Oh yeah, true, he isn't metagaming. <laughs> Look, uh, as far as you know, here or not, he is not here. Okay. So uh, as, as you all start <laughs> He's currently in the back of the room and going, Oh shit, what the fuck is going on? <laughs> Fucking so, uh, artillery all, airstrikes go at the eating, griffin. As you all are eating, beginning your rest, you start hearing a loud windy noise and you see the griffin descend from the air with a asleep dwarf oh, on his back my God, can i technically still have can i still technically have uh speak with animals are we gonna met no him that no it's 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 been a while you i will like i will recast speak with animals <laughs> cast okay. uh casted um griffin for future warning i can only talk to you for for so long uh, uh, do you bring us news? We we, we didn't find anything. <laughs> oh, okay, that was in character. Sorry, I, I thought you. No, no, that, that, that's in character. You, like the, you can tell the Griffin is very tired from having to carry a little bit, carry a little bit of extra weight on his back. You, also, you you see it start to like fall over on its side, and you see the asleep dwarf on his back also fall off the griffin as the griffin falls to the floor. Is he is he conscious, the griffin, or no? The the, the griffin's just laying down right now. He wants to go to bed. Ethan, it's your choice if you wake up from the fall. Uh, yes. Oh come on! It'd be funny if you didn't. So you, you wake up after being. Kind of not necessarily tossed, but shut like just pushed off the griffin. Mm -hmm. Oh, wait, oh, oh, uh, in character, where where am I? What happened? Who are you? Oh, oh it's just you guys. <laughs> uh, wow. Ethan, wow. you see a fire fire lit and a bird and Azriel. I'm a, I'm a big broad black man named Requeen. <laughs> Uh, you know, Ethan, as you awake, you start to feel your stomach rumble. 
Oh, looks like I'm a wee bit hungry. Now he's doing the fucking accent. Took four <laughs> sessions. It's like ten, actually. However many, I don't know. Uh, so you can consume a ration, unless you want to start continuing forward hungry. Uh, well, are we resting? You are. You are resting. It's just more of you're also eating before. By any chance, Marty, do you think we're gonna finish before midnight? Yeah, yeah. I can always no. cut it early. Well, no, 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 I'm just curious, like, how, how much further this is going to go. 11 was my plan. Oh, wow, well, okay. We started Four hours late. Like <sighs> yeah. No, 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 I just thought we were nearing the end. That's, that's why I was, but I was just wanting to double yeah. check. Um, how close were you, by the way, to finishing? 11. So, wait, oh, how right. much time has passed? Uh, In game? Yeah. About... Hour and a half. Hour 45 and okay, 26 so seconds. My, my, uh, my speak with animals has dissipated. Yeah, it, it, it's dissipated. Uh, Geary has recasted it. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and recast it as well. Okay. So I can speak with my griffin friend. <laughs> uh, I'm assuming we, I'm assuming we didn't find pervert. anything, griffin friendo. No. Ugh. <sighs> And I said uh, no. Didn't hear me. Yeah, I did. I'm just trying to think. So, is it what time of day is it? Is it nighttime or day? It's uh, nearing nightfall. Well, I should say it's not nearing. It's pretty much dusk. It's about to be night. All right. Well, I guess because it's getting late, let's go ahead and uh, show up here, Griffin. I see you're already going to sleep. Take so. a take a long rest. <laughs> <laughs> let's take a. <laughs> we'll see you in the morning, Griffin. Okay, and with that, everyone can take a long rest. I'm a mere long rest. <laughs> oh, also XP for. Uh, yes. Apparently, I casted merge with stone. Wait, we're taking a long rest, but our oh. You all Wait. get 150 XP. Oh, cool beans. Wait a minute. What? what? Recovering only, or I mean, uh, long rest only recovers three spell slots. It was, it, no, it gets all of it. Everything. Oh, it says up to two hit dice, three spell slot. I think it's... It, wait, so what do you say? Wait, are you, did you click short rest or long rest? No, long rest. You said 150, Brody? Mm-hmm. Huh. It just, yeah, it resets everything. Basically. I mean, that's what I thought it did. It's just, I mean, I it's not a huge deal because I've only used three spell slots anyway. I'm just, I, I, I surprised yeah, uh, me. Yeah, no, that's it why it's saying only recover three spell slots, Luke. Is it? Uh, I'll, is I'll, it because I'll, you expended I'll, three. Well, it says up two, like that, that's the max it can do. No, so up two confident. because you spent three. Because you spent three. Okay. Okay. So on the next day. You guys, and you guys were at medium, right? Yeah, I am old. Mm -hmm. yeah. I lost my temporary so, health. So I, as the Griffin picks up Ethan again to continue forth. Oh shit, what was the XP? Sorry. 150. Uh, 150. You all march forward, not encountering anything. On the... And Ethan, you do not encounter anything either. Mm -hmm. Just imagine fighting in midair. On um, the next day, <sighs> you all get struck by light. <laughs> you guys don't find anything. And on the, on the next day, you all march forward, and in the middle of your march, or while you guys are in the middle of your march, Ethan, go ahead, wait, let me, let me just double check something. Ethan, go ahead and make a survival check. 
survival check or save? Check. Okay. It's not survival save. Yeah, yeah, I saw that. Survival attack. 20. And I just want to see. <laughs> I think you're going to say two. <laughs> Ethan, as you're flying above, you see an ice method running mm -hmm. through the forest. As your eyes kind of start following it, you see almost a wrecked building in the ice. An ice what? I tap the griffin on the back, and he looks up at me as I point down to the building, gesturing to land there. As you head towards, as you head towards the random building, through the wind-whipped snow and biting cold, you see the full half-submerged dark blue stone building poking up through the ice. A gray stone door is carved to look like a face with a half-exposed skull. Hmm. And there's, also, there's also a text above the door that you can't quite read. Ferdy, for future reference, use a different browser when having the campfire up, because I have an idea where we're about, where we're about to be. No, I, I have that just in case. Oh. Well, I'm thinking he's saying. I think he's saying because you know you can see. I can the see the tab. Way. Yeah, I know you can see the tab. Oh, okay. I, okay. Don't meta game, Joseph. I'm. Mean, it's like I, I can't no, not Joseph, meta game. Joseph, I have the tab there. There's no guarantee that you were to get there. Okay, so At that's all. if we it's, get. It's there. more of just. So we're not there, there yet. I I don't want to see you guys. I don't want you guys to see me scrambling for tabs. Nor do I um, want anything new. Okay. Okay. Never mind. Sorry. I just want to make sure. Okay. Yeah. No. I, I know you can see it. Wait. Um. So it's a. I, I'm going to walk up to the door and open it. Where are we, by the way? After Oh, actually, first, I'm going to... You guys are still uh, walking through. I'm going to gesture to the griffin to stay behind me while I walk up to the door. As you approach the door... Uh, I just want to see something... As you approach the door, you notice two ice methods sitting next to, sitting near the door, ice. waiting for someone to open it. Wait, ice what? Ice method. Method. I have no idea what that is. It's just a small little creature, kind of like a imp. Oh. Hmm. Um. Well, looking up what an ice method is. <laughs> <clears throat> so yeah, I'll just I'll go ahead and open up the door. Uh, as you approach the door, you notice that ice covers every part of it. Although you may think you can see past the ice. So it's not thick ice. Mm -hmm. Can I do an arcana check on the ice? Uh, you can. Okay. I'm actually, I'm also going to use guidance. So I'm going to roll a d4 beforehand. Is guidance a cantrip? Yes. It's concentration camp. Right? Concentration camp. <laughs> Sorry. Cool. Sorry. So, and then Arcana. A 27. Wow. <clears throat> wow. As you investigate the ice, you realize that there's nothing magical about the ice. Thought so. It's just ice. <clears throat> okay. Um. Wait, this is four stick. All right, I would like to start chipping away at the ice with my uh, shovel. Uh, the shovel's coming more in handy, more handy than fucking will. I have a pick. Go ahead and roll a strength check. Strength check. Thirteen. So as you're banging the shovel against it, it's not quite forcing. It's not quite doing enough damage to actually get rid of the ice. 
Are we anywhere near? Uh, you are all still about eight miles away. Oh. Okay, um, thank you for clarifying. I glance over at the griffin, ask, uh, actually, I can't ask him anything because the time's worn out, hasn't it? Uh, since we slept last time I talked. Since you slept, yeah, if you wanted to recast it. Yeah, I'll go ahead and recast it. Cast. Ready. I asked the griffin, hey, is there any chance you could uh, do anything about this door? The griffin walks up to the door. He kind of... He just kind of mutters like, I'll try. Thank you. And with, with his claws, he slashes at the doors, which create two massive gashes, but don't get rid of the ice. Are the gashes, like, deep enough, like, where I can touch the door if I were to stick my hand through it, or, like, stick my fingers through it? No. Or... No. Um... Can you read the language above the door, by chance? Griffin? The griffin cannot. Oh, righty. Um, I'm going to circle the building to see if there's anything around it or any other entrance. Can I do it? That would be investigation, right? Okay. Uh, that will would. But as, as you start circling towards the edge of the building, you quickly notice that everything besides from what you could like this front wall is practically submerged or at least somewhat submerged in water. Hmm. So there'd be no point in doing investigation check. Unless you wanted to swim. Okay. Jackson's not here, so he can't swim for me. Okay. Oh. No, oh, that wouldn't work. Does the can I do an investigation check on the ice that's covering the front door to see if like any way I can bust it open? Uh, sure. Okay. Uh, you hit the wrong button. Okay. Once again, because I can, I'm gonna use guidance. Before four, this fucking guy and his guidance. Two. Shut up! It's an extra buff just in case. Oh, yes, two and then investigation. 14, 16, 18. Okay. Upon investigating it, you kind of see that the ice is mainly held on through the top and the bottom of the door. So if you had a strong enough blunt impact, you may be able to crack it open. I'd like to use Thunder Wave, level <laughs> two, and blast the level door two. open. Level two! Why'd you use the level two to do that? Just use the level one. Fuck you, I'm going all in. I'm wasting all the spells. <laughs> okay, go ahead. Okay. Thunder Wave, level two. Seventeen. Okay. So with the thunder wave, the ice starts to shake, and with one fell swoop of a rock being launched at the, or like an ice shard being launched at it through the thunder wave, the ice starts shattering due to a hole created in the center. It is not quite destroyed, but you can now probably pick away at it. Okay, yeah, I'll pick away at it with my shovel. Okay. So with that, the ice goes off. Uh, everyone not here, go ahead and make a survival check. Okay. Okay. Survival, survival <laughs> would be down here. I want to kill myself. <laughs> I'm good. Okay. Um...
So, Azrael, you, as everyone's approaching on, you can see faintly in the distance an imp-like creature going in a direction. Yeah. Okay. Would you like the creature is completely igno- completely ignoring you, but has a set destination in mind? What would you like to do? Investigate it. Uh, sure. Go ahead and roll and invest. Well, okay, cool. Parker. From what you can tell, this thing doesn't look friendly, but it hasn't seemed to notice you. Okay. Uh, is my sword lighting up or anything? No. Okay. Um. Can I keep watch on the the creature? The imp? Uh, you can, but it is walking. Would you like to follow it? Sure, sure. And would you like to beckon other people with you? Yes, but to stay uh, further out of sight so it is not to be or not to be startled. Wraith, you here? Yeah, I'm here. Would you like to follow? Sure. And is Gary here? <coughs> yes, I'll follow. Okay. Oh. I might have to actually try that then. So as all of you, all of you follow this creature, it continuously walks continually walks through the forest in a winding path back to Ethan. Now that you have the door chipped away, I'll go ahead and open it and peer inside. Okay. Uh, Wait, this thing led us to Ethan. What? No. No, no, it didn't. Oh, back. Yeah, I'm mind. Back. yeah, yeah. Sorry, you transitioned. My bad. Fucking idiot. As you cra- crack open the door, you can see some stone, oh. uh, some stone walls and stone flooring past the metal door. Can I? Well, I have dark vision, so how f- deep can I see, like completely? You can see. Obviously, forty-five feet. But... What the fuck? And we're gonna just pass on over. From what oh. you can see, you see the faint entrance of a building. Um, I'm gonna use actually no. Fuck, I don't. I'm just gonna walk deeper into the place. But very slowly. Do you want to stealth? Yeah, that'd probably be the best idea. Go ahead and roll a stealth. First doing wow, guidance. That, if that wasn't a roll, if that wasn't a tip, then I don't know. <laughs> One. Okay. So, two, two. 20. Okay. As you enter the building, sticking close to the walls, you start hearing a rattling from another room. You see, and let me fix the fog real quick, just so you're not clipping into something. And I will fully clear out the room so you can kind of see what's going on. As you enter the room, you hear a rattling, and you see the shoe of a suit of armor fly into the room. Can I do an arcana check on the foot? Uh, you can, yes. But that wouldn't—that would would that pull me out of stealth? 
Uh, if you want to do it from afar, then no. No. And how close is it to me? But... It's uh, about right here. Would that be close enough to pull me out of stealth? You would have to sneak closer to it. Okay. So if I just do an arcana check from this distance, I'll be fine? Uh... Yeah, but I'm going to say do it at disadvantage if you're trying not to break stealth. Okay, uh, in that case, rolling guidance again. Doing that every time, because I can. Four, poggers. And then, counter check, snatch. Eight, so, four, three, twelve, god. Okay. So you can sense a rather strong energy from this. It almost feels familiar. Um, it busted to a door to my right, right? Uh, the door that's ajar. Yeah. Um, can I'm gonna sneak up to that door and peer inside. As you sneak across the room to the wall. You see more pieces of armor fly into the room as a suit of animated armor enters. Wait, does it, it, hasn't, it, hasn't seen, it, ha it hasn't seemed to notice you quite yet, although it is on high guard. I want to sneak past it into the room it came from. Okay. So, he's kind of blocking the doorway. Do you want to roll a stealth check to try to sneak past him? This is not perception-based. Yes. Okay. Guidance all the way, obviously. Guidance, two, and stealth. Fuck. <laughs> Seven. Okay. Let me just... Oh, shit. So as you approach oh, the room, you try to squeeze through the door, but you accidentally nudge it and a creak is heard. As you're in this room, You've made enough noise that you have alerted the suit of armor. And as you sneak into the room, you also notice a second suit of armor. Go ahead and roll initiative. Is he thinking it die? Nat 20! <laughs> of course I roll a nat 20 on when I'm a fucking lone. Okay. Uh, Ethan, what would you like to do? You have first action. Uh, I'd like to cast Blade Ward on myself. It's a cantrip. Okay. And with that, I'd like to, with my bonus action, wait, yeah. I want to quickly go to the opposite end of the room I just entered. So, to the door you just snuck to? Or stuck past? So, I the door I just entered, the opposite side of that. Okay, so you want to just get on the opposite side of the door? Yeah. Or, so, look, you see the, the door on the left side of the... Mm -hmm. Yeah, I want to yeah. get over there. That side. Go. Okay. So the side um, of the room. Let me just... So, you want to get here? No. Or you want to go here? No, other left, left. Oh, here? Yeah. So as you run, we're going to do, does a 12 hit? No. Okay. As you dash past, uh, you see the arm of one of the suits of armor go towards you, but miss you and dink against the wall. Is there anything else you'd like to do? Uh, I don't think, is there anything else you can do? No, there isn't. I did an action. And then yeah. Okay. 
the first suit of armor walks up towards you and a nine does a nine hit no does a 18 hit yes okay. you take three damage Okay. With this, the other suit of armor also works. Are you scared of a TPK? <gasps> no. <laughs> <laughs> My death requires all of you to die. Does a 18 hit? 18 does hit. So you take two damage. Yeah, you take two damage. As one of the arms bangs up against you, and as you see a foot uh, miss and just kind of hit the other animated suit of armor, but just kind of knock the pieces away as they spring back to place. It's your turn. What would you like to do? I would like to cast Enhance Ability on myself. And use Bear's Endurance to give myself temporary HP. Uh. Okay, go ahead and do the roll of how much temporary HP you're gonna get. You've got to be fucking kidding me. Three. Okay, so you get three HP. Um, and for a bonus action, um, I'm going to use, actually it's an action, wait, no it's not, I'm going to use Bardic Inspiration, and cast it on myself. Uh, other than yourself. Mm-hmm. What did I put on myself? As a bonus action, a creature other than yourself within 60 feet. Oh, yeah. Well, then I'm going to determine tail from Tales of Beyond. Is that a go or no go? Okay, yeah, you can do that. Right. So I need to roll almost a d12. That is Beast. Recite a tale from a clever animal for one minute. The target has advantage on wisdom, second check, advantage rolls. Against creature from another enemy is within five feet of an enemy is an incapacity. Okay. So yeah, that's all I can do. So one of the knights hits you for uh, three damage. Okay. With one of his arms missing with his other attack. Good thing I used that. Is Ethan gonna die? I mean, who, just who, I mean who knows? What, 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 the second passion. knight throws both its head and its chest, hitting you, doing. Okay, wait. Two things, because I mm -hmm. accidentally miscalculated on one. The okay. first knight actually did five damage, not three. Okay. Because I forgot your thing ended. The second knight does a total of 12 damage on both attacks. It's your turn. What would you like to do? Um... I'm going to use my Thunder Wave level 1 and after that try to get out of the room. Okay, go ahead. Five. Uh...
both knights are pushed back and take five damage. Being pushed to the door of the room. And you said you wanted to try to run past them? Yes. So after getting knocked back, you run past them. Both knights get an opportunity attack. Fuck. Both do miss, though. Oh, thank God. What do you want to do? Uh, you saw a little want, movement. I want to get as close to the outside door as possible. Uh, I believe... Yeah, okay. So you get about there. Okay. The other, the first knight, leaves the room to chase you. But misses both of its attacks. And the second knight runs up to you. When it's running, can I do an opportunity? Like a... No, it's when it's running away. Oh, okay. Lands one attack, doing four damage. Four. Okay. And it's your turn again. What would you like to do? I'm gonna. I'm just gonna book it out the door. Uh. Okay. You book it out the door. And I'm going to hide underneath the wing of my griffin friend. As you are leaving, the first knight misses its attack. The second knight lands an attack on you, doing four damage. And I'm knocked. Because there is no other party members nearby, the next knight gets to go. doing eight damage so Ethan for that you would just be just keep in mind the eight damage of your total pool and put two negative two death saves okay and the next knight hits you for another attack sadly you are the first person to die in this campaign you've got to be kidding oh me oh my god it oh, happened no, no way it happened oh Oh god. my god. <clears throat> Are you fucking no serious? No fucking way, dude. Oh wow. God. Wait, okay. I have a question. I, I was doing some homework went before Ethan encountered this fight. Did he go in no like like on his own willingly or was he like expecting us or like well, what was the options? Oh no, Ethan went in there willingly. <laughs> yeah, no, I went in there to more I went in there stealth oh, to observe. No. And I tried to sneak past the first night to get to check into see what was in the next room where he came no. from and i made the door squeak because i didn't do well on my stealth or my uh yeah my stealth and then that initiated combat and i tried to like escape right. somewhat ethan time to make a dryad <laughs> or dryad true okay. sorry dude oh, bitch wow i'm sorry ethan that... but you are out for the rest of this yes, all right that gives me brody. time to work on my new character yes brody that was pong Oh my god. Right, going going back to the rest of you. Oh my god. We don't even know he's dead! Upon, we don't even- this, Wait, this, do we know? We're- also flies away. Oh the, 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 griffin kind of, the griffin kind of sees you get like pummeled and killed by these animated suits of armor. Uh, then it leaves not wanting to get injured itself. Verdi, <laughs> did, did, did you think it was a dumb idea for Ethan to try and sneak past? Or oh, 100%. Like... <laughs> yeah. I was waiting for, I was trying to like, I was waiting for Ethan to be like, okay, I'm going to go back and tell the rest of my team. Yeah, I don't know why. Well, I was still, I was still eight miles away. It wouldn't take him uh... like five minutes to get there. Uh, in game, like out of game time, it would have taken you about one to two minutes. Oh. <laughs> oh. 
Oh, Patience shit. is a virtue, okay. my friend. Patience is a virtue. Oh shit! Actually, I launched. Actually, I launched Jota. Okay. But there you go, Brody Joseph. Brody finally did it. He Joseph, I gave it. you. So I gave Brody you what you wanted. The rest of the party, oh, you did. <gasps> Beans. I dropped him <laughs> all. I, I was. We should have ended the session earlier, dog. No. <laughs> I was. It was really awkward because Ethan was dying and I was dropping beans all over the place. There's a bunch of beans on the ground right now. <laughs> Dude, most of that we're having a conversation. I was like, Dude, no, my beans! Wait, go, going back to the rest oh of my God. the party. The worst part uh, is, is we don't even guys... know that... I know. He's dead. You guys are following the ice method. Or this little imp. And after... As night starts to fall, as you've been about following him for six hours, you do eventually come across a building sitting somewhat submerged in the water. Oh. Wait, say that again? Sorry. You, you all come across a building somewhat submerged in the water. Okay. Can I investigate it? I w Actually, what's your uh, investigation, Gary? Do you want to investigate it, or do you want to approach it? I, wait, do I have a higher investigation than you? Uh, I don't know what your investigation is. I'm Mine is minus three. Okay, I have way higher than you. Uh, <laughs> to investigate it, you do need to get somewhat close to it. Okay, right before now... I do so, before I do so, is anything happening with my sort of warning? Uh, No. Okay, then I'll approach it and investigate. As you... So as you approach it through wind whipped snow and biting cold, you see this dark blue stone building poking through the ice. You also notice the gray stone door is carved to look like the face of a half exposed skull, with some letters above it that you can't quite understand. Can can I or do I can I invest can I figure out what it, language it is? Through investigation or whatever. Uh, is everyone else following him? Yes. Yeah. I really, yeah. You know, I just made a realization. I gave this guy my wings, or my my feathers, <laughs> and then he just died. <laughs> well, you don't know he's dead yet. So uh, as you all approach, and well, as you're trying to kind of figure out what this is, Joseph, you can clearly read that, or I shouldn't say clearly, but you can struggle to read that it says Saul's fault. Oh shit. Why oh shit? <laughs> well, uh, uh. Character no. backstory. <laughs> no, no, no. This is. Is this not the place where Ethan was? No. Oh, was it? Okay. Oh, no. never mind. No, because didn't he say it was the half yeah. the skull face door? I don't know. What would like you guys do? Okay. You do see that the little guy you were following has walked into the building. Do we trust this little ice nymph? <sighs> Can I roll an animal handling to check? Uh right now he's out of your sight. You, he's just, you just okay. you just saw that he walked in the building. Yeah, uh, I'll walk in cautiously. Yeah, I'll, can Gary, you're gonna be the tank How of the group. How do you walk in cautiously? Do -do, do -do, do -do. I walk so, in humming that tune, and I'm very do careful. Do you want to roll in. stealth? Yeah, I roll stealth, sure. <laughs> I walk in humming that let me, tune. Let me roll out disadvantage. Oh! Did you pog I'm out? I'm 20 and 16, holy shit. <laughs> he pogged out. So, yeah. I, I, so as you approach the door, you, slow, you slowly open it, being sure not to make any noise, and the door seems to get stuck. And enough for you to still get in, but you are, it is only being able to be opened ha about halfway without force. Can I peek my head through? Mm-hmm. Uh, okay. You, okay, so as you peek your head through, and let me go ahead and reopen the map for you. Damn. Damn. Just has got to be the first to react. I just realized that I do have to be the first. No, I, I'll... I'll... I is can't Ethan right now. We should deafen Ethan. Can we deafen Ethan? 
Yeah. Well, no, no. that's going to be fine, muted. I, I still want to listen. I'm just going to... Yeah, no, it's fine. No, that you no, stay no, no, but you dead. <laughs> he doesn't know <laughs> shit! So, Joseph, as, as, you, as you approach, <laughs> you keep your head in to oh, see the body no. of a <laughs> bloody and beaten dwarf laying on the ground. <laughs> Oh, I, I oh my god! Hearing, I'm, hearing, I'm actually sad. Hearing Geary like freak the fuck out. I want, I would, I'd like to approach him cautiously and ask what's up. Little stealth. Uh, where's my fucking page? Uh, stealth. Oh, fuck. Fifteen. Okay. So as you approach, you kind of <laughs> tap Geary on the shoulder. Trying to figure out what's wrong. Geary? G Geary, what's... What's wrong? Geary, speak to me. I... You're kind of in... I can't see. Is there something wrong? That damn griffin. The, the griffin? I love how you blame the griffin. I'm so happy. The, what about the griffin? It tricked us. Well, what where, where are you talking about there? Gary? Nornix. Nornix dead. What, what do you mean, Nornix dead? He's dead on the other side of this fucking door. I, can I push him out of the way and check? I, I push him out of the uh, way. Yes. Can I roll a strength check? <laughs> <laughs> What are you rolling a strength check for? To stay where you are? Yes. <laughs> yeah, I'm being dead serious when I say this. Sure. Well, <laughs> strength for holding in the tears. Strength for holding in the tears. Right, no, Will, Will, you roll strength. Roll strength, no, Will. he did. He did. What did he roll? Actually, did, I? did he? No, I haven't yet. Yeah, he... he you, no, he did. It was 15. You M. Night Shyamalan. No, that was... Roll no, oh, strength, you M. Night Shyamalan. 16. Oh, 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 oh. Let's go! Because... <laughs> <laughs> As you peep your head in, being sure not to touch the door too much, you see Nornik's mangled corpse on the floor. Holy shit! I decide to follow them. Oh my god, we couldn't have waited a little few more levels till I get my resurrection spell. Why? <laughs> Why did he go off alone? It was that fucking griffin. It was the. It was that griffin. God damn it. How do you know it was I, the Griffin? Uh, out, How do we know? I it, can I invest? Can we? Spray. I would like to investigate the body to figure out what killed him. Uh, so to do that, you need to enter. Either that, or you need to drag his corpse outside. I'll try. Gary, can I'll you drag it. his corpse outside? I'll, yeah. Does that require a strength check? Uh, can I steal from his uh, body? <laughs> that requires. <laughs> I kind of want his coins. No, dragging him out, it would just mean he would move at half move speed. Or, yeah. Slide of hand. What if he slide of hand? What's your slide of hand, Will? No, I'm six, by the way. Come on. Oh, okay. I have to do it. Okay. Okay. Oh, my As you're dragging him out, you see this tiny blood trail being left behind as you drag the body out and drop it onto the snow. All the while, making a rustling due to Ethan's loose gear and weaponry. As you drop him onto the snow, you start hearing a faint rustling from inside the building. One that sounds like metal. The sound. Uh, it's very it's familiar. It's familiar. Is it his not? body out of here, I ready my weapons. <laughs> I pull out my instrument describing, playing a very sad tune, but writing on the wall that it was probably uh one of the metal figures that we faced in the in the basement uh you mean uh, or the, the sound the sound the, the sound sounded like yeah that's it, the most Fault. meta game I've that is really meta game no, it doesn't, I'm matter. To go it doesn't the, matter i'm gonna I'm investigate play of the of the iron armor i guess you know i'm trying to say it sounds like it uh so Azure, would you like to do anything i would like to confirm this suspicion by investigating Okay, so as you two, as he was dragged uh, Nornik's corpse outside, you see lots of blunt trauma and in death indents on parts of his body and armor. You also see that there is a slight 
incline on his forehead, so almost like a bull. Someone smoked a bowl in his forehead. <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Well, you well. Kidding, Giri, due to your guard, you do see a piece of animated armor has appeared from the door to the right of the dungeon. And that's character's right. By any chance, that chest plate that Ethan had, uh, could I uh, take it? <laughs> I'm not to wear it. <laughs> Do, no, he should be fine. I don't think there's. I, I think so. If I, not him, I can. Yours the one that required the strength. Yeah. Uh, I'm just. I'm... I think Ethan's didn't. Because I remember I was originally going to try and take it. Anything off of Nornik's body. I'll take that in my feathers. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, stick them back in you. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Okay. Wait. Uh, let's. No. Let's. Let's. I mean, this is kind of mean, but. Hey, we yeah, gotta so survive. Out here. You want to split his goals? What do you boys? mean? You I'm goals? an asshole. You guys are assholes! Okay. There's a possible Absolute. threat in this building, and you guys are trying He's outside, so we know. Luke, Luke, as I want armor you, for the fight. Uh, Luke, as you uh, reach for his armor, go ahead and add a... Do you know how to add equipment? Uh, I think so. Isn't it manage uh, equipment? Uh, yeah, and manage, then you need manage to add equipment. Items. Type in yeah. smoldering armor, and then go to breastplate. Smoldering armor, breastplate, and then add... It's the medium armor, right? Yes. To give you yeah. an IC of 14. Uh, do I have to like equip it or something? Uh, yes. yeah, go ahead and equip it. Oh, wait, why do I have a. I have a disadvantage on fucking sleight of hand and stealth now? What the fuck? Okay. Uh, oh, did wait. you want your feathers back? Did he say you wanted that? Uh, sure, I guess. Um, okay. Also, uh, could I take this on and off, like, depending on the situation? You can, but it takes, like, an action. Oh, okay. So right now, right like, now you yeah, just have it. You don't, you don't have okay. it on. Do you want to put it on with the action? Yeah, I want to put it on. Okay. 16 armor class is kind of nice. And I will go ahead and add the custom item to your inventory. The feathers. <laughs> and we'll just split his gold, probably. Yeah, um, we'll... I'm not sure how much he had. But he way I'm not going to be stingy and he steal it. <laughs> I'm not, I'm not he has 116. Gonna... No, he does not. He has 116 gold. I am looking right now. Wow, you will fucking I only have three No, hold on. If if I if I could if I could his thing is it just Which dead? I can I I, won't, I I I gently put my my hand on Wraith's shoulder and I and I whisper to him I have to come clean about something. Remember when I blackmailed him? You blackmailed him? Yeah. When I told him don't Wait, kill when? the guy. Oh yeah yeah yeah. He stole 50 gold. That was for the party. <laughs> <laughs> and I didn't tell you. And I'm sorry. Okay. It's... <laughs> also, uh, Luke, upon, upon looting the body, you got your feathers back and you see that he has five of your feathers. I start beating his corpse. <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> So, Listen. with a firm kick to his core, <laughs> the animated armor now knows where you are. Oh, you, you fucking, fucking ass. And starts approaching the door as the other one comes out. Okay, uh -oh. okay, 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 okay. Let's think so, this through, guys. Let's think this through. The animated armor not seeing you, everyone go ahead and roll initiative. Fuck. <laughs> God damn it, the sorry death. The it was gonna death. see us either way. No, it's fucking. I got okay. 14. Um. <laughs> Worst comes to worst, I have the fallback of darkness. Uh, I ten. Nine. This man really did steal five of my feathers. He stole fifty of your gold, <laughs> dude. I know that guy stole so much gold. I didn't realize he stole that much. What the fuck? Get this guy out of the game. <laughs> you're a little fucking. You're a little fucking rat. <laughs> <laughs> you guys do not know how to board a body. Oh, that, that was out of character. <laughs> I know. Uh, Gary, Gary is genuinely like depressed right now. He is. He's. Gary, uh, if, Gary, if, see, I'm shaking you, Gary. We have to fucking snap out of it for just a little bit. Just a little bit to kill them. We have to avenge him. Do you want to avenge your fallen brother? I'm going to mash these fucking piles of armor. Uh huh. Sometimes karma has a way of working. Up? You're gonna fuck him up? <laughs> okay. 
Come on, uh, come I'm gonna declass into barbarian. <laughs> <laughs> Rage. The five leaf clover. The, 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 the first piece of armor walks out of the building and launches an attack at you, Will. Fuck. Does a nineteen hit? Uh, give me a sec. No. <laughs> Let me equip my armor real quick. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yes. Uh, you take three damage from its head flying at you. Okay. Okay, so these guys don't and... do a lot of damage, but they do consistent damage. Yeah, and his leg also flies at you, but misses you and flies off a little bit into the distance over here. Does that count as uh, running away? No. Okay. Well, I'm just wondering. You it, it need to be like a counter attack thing if you want to do attack that. Uh, Wait, are those ranged attacks? Are they considered ranged attacks? Uh, I'd consider that a ranged attack. <laughs> the fuck? It, okay, it's a ranged attack, but the animated suit of armor isn't necessarily gonna launch it at you unless he's close. Because it's like if he does it from a range, it's so easy to dodge and you can just grab it. Okay, like, it loses a lot thing. of power. It loses a lot War of power. Warding wind gives that a disadvantage, or it gives ranged weapons a disadvantage inside and outside. Yeah. Think of so it the like whole a, thing, think of it like a, a disadvantage. Yeah. Just think of it like a boomerang that's super short range. It's like at, okay, the, so at the apex of it, it's going to be moving like literally like zero because it's coming. So back. they would have a disadvantage. They would have a disadvantage. They would have a disadvantage, but it wouldn't even do oh. damage because you could literally just smack it away from you. So basically, I can't take damage with warding wind. <laughs> You can't take you can't take damage from these guys as a ranged attack because they don't have a ranged attack. Okay. Uh, so Luke, it's your turn. What would you like to do? I mean, I guess I'll cast Warding Winds. If I mean, from what you were saying, it sounded like that's a good way to work against them. Uh, I'm. Well, you, you said it, it would it would be a disadvantage. Didn't as a didn't ranged you say that? attack. Oh, but so it's they, like they, just... they don't necessarily have a ranged attack. It's more of, while it's connected to the mass of energy, it's considered a melee, but they can like launch the limb and then call it back to them. That launching okay. though is kind of more of a dream. I would, I would I call would that. That's really not. That's a twenty. Range. No, I would count that as ranged. Think about it. If it's a twenty mile in my twenty mile an hour wind, that's around him. That's magical. Brody, unless there's a unless there's like a physical, so I'd say attached yeah. to it, pushing it, then it, I'd say. It, Okay, that's fine. Yeah. Okay. Like, I know it's like magical. A pike. It was like a pike with a thing on the end? Yeah, if it was like a flail, where it was like a mass attached to something, and technically it is loose, but at the yeah. same time... It, yeah, it's yeah. just, it's strong magic. That's the whole issue. It's strong magic. I don't know. I, uh, for, for me, I'd probably say... Well, it has disadvantage. Okay, okay then I'll, ca I'll cast Warding Wind. Then. I'll cast Warding Wind. Okay. I just don't realize, we lost our, uh, our buffer. <laughs> yeah, he's we gone. lost. A, we lost a huge part of our team. Uh, I guess he, he body moved out of the way. <laughs> you have to move it. Fuck, I'm not going. To... I'll use my wind to just blow it away. <laughs> so as wind starts picking up, both you, Ezreal, and you, Giri, start feeling a raging wind at both your sides and your backs. I am 425 pounds. It is not affecting me. <laughs> just not saying, I'm not saying, it, uh, not saying it affects you. It's more of just, it's there now. Okay. Uh, I believe it is Azriel's turn. Uh, fuck. What would you like to do? Wait, weren't we in stealth? No, we didn't. We didn't ever stealth. I, I did. The body we aren't that. stealth because Luke fucking get the body. Was uh, it group? It wasn't grouped. It was us I two and Vidal. We the whole thing is it was, it was stealth, and you guys were peeping your head ends. Uh, yeah, but we dragged the body out. It, it noticed. I that, it, it noticed. Here. It noticed you because of Luke kicking the body. I, I, I don't know. I call bullshit, but whatever. <laughs> Okay, what, what are you trying to get at? I'm just wondering if I could get away without getting the opportunity attack because I'm 
technically I never unstealth. Here's the whole issue, right? Yeah. These guys can't see. Yeah, this, but this is like echo location. They just don't know where to look until you make a noise. Are you saying your character remained like perfectly motionless throughout all of this? No, but at the mm. well, to be fair, we... we did talk. Yeah. Remember how we were talking about the money and you know, like the the stuff and all that. I mean, it's not. I I don't really actually know, but I don't know if we were stealth during that. Uh, let me look, we look. let the DM decide. We let the DM decide. I'm gonna say you're not stealthed, but as a little forgiveness, I'll roll an inspiration dice for you. And you got lucky, it's a six. Okay. What does inspiration do? Isn't that like extra damage? Okay. It's what you can essentially do with Bardic. You can just add it to whatever you like, really. Okay. It's a fair point, so I'll, I'll I'll give you an inspiration. Okay. Um. But no. shoot. Let me. Ah, oh, fuck. Cause. Hmm. Cause there's multiple things I can do right now. Honestly, the smoke I don't think would be a terrible idea. They don't have the healing, so. Yeah, but do you really want to deal with it? It's kind of like. Mega cheese. Well, I still have my scimitar. I have my scimitar. I can get free damage. Out I get. I guess nine. it's more. It's. I guess. Question: Do you count? Do you? Oh, fuck. What's it called? There's. There's. There's a, a word for it, but I don't know if you. You. You actually want it in your game. Mm -hmm. Um. Apparently, you can get advantage if you position yourself behind someone. Me and Zer oh, were talking backstabs? about it. Yeah, backstabs. Does that work um, in this scenario? Well, they use echo no, location. Back, so for I me, backstabs is like the stealth bonus that you get from like rogues and shit. You're, you're not Shem, Ricky, Will. You're not, you're, you're not necessarily known in the arts of sneaking or assassinations, so why would your character know to do it? Or at least if can, they were to do I it, can. they wouldn't do it properly. Luke can, yeah. Luke yeah, yeah. definitely. Yeah. Well, I was just wondering, because... But it's more of like... It. Sorry. It's uh, more of like, let's, yeah, let's, yeah. Let's, let's use TF2 as a weird example, okay? Okay. The spy can backstab you, right? Mm -hmm. He has to be stealthed for it, though. Or at least, like, be sneaky. He can face stab you. Is that fun, though? No. Is it practical? No. <laughs> if you know it's coming, it shouldn't be that damn effective. Yeah. And so you kind of, in my opinion, backstabs are just out of stealth strikes. And you can get advantage for those. But that's the most you'd be able to get. And I'm pretty sure advantage is even just with the rogue class. I'm pretty sure that's what they do. Okay, well, shit. Fuck it. Um, Geary, you're gonna have to become frontliner in a sec because I don't want to take that much damage. I but, am the frontliner. Yeah, right. You're in right, the back right now. Though. Yeah, right now you're in the back. I'm taking the. Fr I, I've been by the door the whole time. You're yeah. behind Ethan and Will's in front of you. That's what yeah. you're saying. Because the armors are focused on me and I can't move away right now. Okay. Then. Just sit quietly, don't make a sound. <laughs> Actually, um, though, could that work? <laughs> yes, if he, if what Brody said is right. Oh, but they already attacked Will. They already attacked yeah. him, so they know his current location. I have an idea. What's your idea? When's it my turn? Someone uh, throw a rock. Next. Who's it's right, uh, it's uh, right now my it's, turn, it's and it's your next turn. Next in the party. It's next in the party. <laughs> Who's that, me? You're next yes. in the, it's for the party, it's Wraith, Azrael, you. Okay. Well then it's turn. What would you like oh. to do? 
You still haven't done anything with your Yeah, I know, I know, I know. I'm trying to figure out what the Hurry. best course of action is. Well, Sorry. Just, just do something okay, and then Joseph can use his turn to get in front of you or something like that. Okay, okay. I'll Eldritch Blast then. Okay, go ahead and roll Does it. Does a 22 hit? <laughs> yes. Go ahead and roll damage. 10. You hit the chest of the animated armor with an Eldritch Blast, sending it recoiling backwards. But after that, it kind of like starts slowly gravitating back towards position. Just now with this hole in the center of it. Okay. Uh, Giri, it is your turn. What would you like to do? Giri. Giri. Gari, Gooey. Alright, I'm already done with it. John oh, Snyder. Hi, baby. Geary. Joseph. Gory. Yeah, I know, I'm here. It's your turn. Oh, sorry. <laughs> um. So, what's the situation? I'm I Eldritch Blast and did 10 damage. I'm going to run forward uh, and absolutely deck the ever living shit out of this first guy with my mace. Use your device. So, I'd, kill myself. I'd say use your device. Do you want to run over Nornik's body or around it? <laughs> I'm going to. Uh, Disrespect. I, I, guess, I guess around it. So, as you run around it. <laughs> I'd have said over. I don't know. I'm gonna There's a 12 hit. <laughs> uh, 12 does not hit. Gear, uh, Nornik's body is under you. Fucker. Put it in there for now. Okay, uh, fine. If that's the case, then I have a, an action to do. I will cast <sighs> Ensnaring Strike on the guy in the doorway. Uh, okay. Let me just... And it's a 1d6 damage if hits. Does it not cast if it doesn't hit? It needs to hit. It needs to hit to cast. Okay, cool. Would you want to do anything else? That That's my bonus action. I'm saying... You can't cast it, so you have another bonus, technically, if you want to do something else, but you don't have to. No, no, no. Ensnaring Strike is a different thing. Ensnaring Strike is a bonus action, Brody. I know. And you can't cast it. Why? Because you did not hit the creature with your mace. No, I, I don't... It's not the same thing. It's a different attack. Ensnaring, ensnaring, ensnaring Strike. The next time you hit a creature... Oh, with the yeah, yeah. Shut I... <laughs> Fuck! Genius! Uh, Getting flanked. Okay, let's see. Actions, bonus actions. Uh, two weapon fighting, what does that mean? If you use a one handed weapon, you can attack twice. You don't. Either. Yeah, okay, so yeah, I, I, got nothing just, I think your turn's just over. It is. It probably is. Hey! Fucking, I'll be back one second. Alright, his turn is it now? Is it mine or is it the other guy's? It is. The other suit of armor. The other suit of armor. Can't quite fit through the doorway. Cool. This is ideal. <laughs> We're, this is very ideal. Thank, thank fuck. So he's just kind of vibing there. Fuck. Okay. I have a plan, but I don't want to. I have an idea, but it's a total risk, and it's gonna be a waste of a turn. Hear me out. Talk, 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 talk us through it. Talk us through it. Okay. So Brody said these guys use echo location, correct? He he, he did. Uh yes. Uh, I Why did don't not. I just? No. Yeah, you did. Because yeah, Will, 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 Will said... don't base it off what I say. Oh, they, they don't okay, see me through sight. Is what I is what I meant to say. It's a like echo location. Oh, okay, because my my original plan was because you said that I was going to use the sound from minor illusion to maybe draw him away. If that's what 
the whole can, thing. Can it could still work. I, <laughs> still I mean, work. it could, but I don't want to waste a turn doing that. I don't want someone to get fucking damaged. Okay. Uh, I don't know. It's your guys' choice. What do you think? Damage or minor? Does a 23 hit? Uh, yeah, it does. Uh, you take four damage. <sighs> All right. I'm now at 32. Is there another attack heading my way or no? No. No. The other one missed. Uh, it is now... Da, 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 right turn. I don't know. What, what do you guys here? think? Do, you, do I do the illusion or no? Just try um, it. Eh. I mean, honestly, rather burst it down. Because, like, yeah, it's, if it's going to... I feel like it'd be smarter, too. It's just, I'd rather waste a no. turn if I could. But if it doesn't waste just a turn, burst. then it's like... Just burst yeah, okay. it. Just burst just, it. Because, like, I here's the thing. Use... I can get away. It's just he can't roll high. That's the thing. This is it. I'm just gonna use Scorching Ray, all of it, on one on the dude right there. Sure. Okay. Uh, he was a 19. No. Uh, 12 is. 12 does not hit. 12 does not hit. I mean, does that mean it counts as a? No, it doesn't no? cast. Doesn't cast. Oh, okay. Cool. Cool. Alright, so what's happening? Luke, uh, if Luke misses his, his score shot, does it not count as a spell? Or does... Oh no, it still counts, he just misses. Oh, haha, <laughs> I'm wrong, I'm wrong. Uh, uh, <laughs> Jennifer, for you, you have... Oh, I have to effect. hit with my... Okay. Luke, Luke's roll to hit is a spell. That's fucking gay, dude. It was at a 19, and then it rolled to a 9. This is how we die. This is how we die. Now I don't have any more second level spells. Wait, Luke, did you get that deafening thing you were talking about? Deafening? Yeah. Or whatever it was called. Mm. Well, there wind. was a... Yeah, warding wind is the deafening thing. Mm. Never mind, then. Never mind. Okay. I don't know <laughs> if there was another one. We'll talk about it after, but... Uh, I'll... Ethan wants to so rest. It is now <laughs> Asriel's turn. What would you like to do? Okay. Um. Well. Shit. Uh. What is the armor focused on? Me or Geary? As of right now, it seems like me, to be honest. I think we should just go off. <sighs> uh, fucking, uh. Intuition, I don't know. Be fucked up. Who's next? Me. I'm trying to think what. Fuck, I'm in such an awkward position. Pretty sure. Uh, do they get an opportunity attack if you were to move behind Geary? Yeah. Uh, five feet. I mean, within their five feet range. That's why. Fuck, dude. Um. Fuck it. I'll slash with my packed weapon, and then as a bonus action. Do I have? Can I hit with my hand axe after? Um, because I'll be one handing one and then one hand the other, or no? <laughs> it, it's the long sword, right? Yeah. If you do the lower one, I believe you can. Yeah, that's that's what I'm talking about. Okay, then fuck it. I'll do that. I'll I'll just. Attack twice. Yeah, I'll do that. Well, I miss with that. Miss or no, fifteen. That is a miss. Fuck. Okay. Sixteen. It is. So as you as you attempt to hit the armor, both the, the longsword and the hand axe kind of just get 
bounced off the metal metal arms and metal shoulders of the body. Uh, Giri, it is now your turn. What would you like to do? I a Shmecha. Go ahead. You pray to Shmecha? Shmecha? I just don't realize, we don't have a healer. I want to do really. myself? I do. <laughs> Me and him both have Lay on uh, Hands, and I have Healing Hands. I have Brody, I want to let you know this now, I have not rolled anything above a 10. <laughs> you need to hit a 16, Joseph. <laughs> Damn. Okay. I have a plus 4, I literally need to roll a 12 or higher. The other armor in the back again just kind of tries to get past the other suit of armor, but generally can't. Uh, the other suit of armor puts up both of its arms, one aiming at Yuri and one aiming at Azriel. Mm. Uh huh. <laughs> I really am just fine. <laughs> uh, does a 15 hit, Will? Can I cast my reaction? My shield. Uh, you can, I believe. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Then I'll I'll I'll, I'll wait. Block it with shield. Reaction. Because that's plus five wait, to my AC. Why do I remember Ethan talking about reactions? Okay. What's oh. up, gamer? Actually, uh. Or can I not? Because I'll unmark that if I can. I'm pretty uh... sure I can because it is a reaction. It says when you're hit by an attack, but I'm going to assume that's not damage, and that's like when the hit has been registered that it hits. So I'm going to say sure. Okay. So, fuck it. Uh... It does not hit. <sighs> Ghost of yes or no? What? Uh, what do you mean? Yes or no? I uh... don't, don't. I fucking hate it when people do that. Uh, I yes. Sure yes. Didn't matter at the fuck off. Why? What, what, what was the what was the context? I had I, 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 ro I rolled a dice and at first I was like, oh, it's for Will's damage. And I was like, wait, he's not taking damage. So I was debating if I roll again for you or not, but it rolled the exact same number. Uh, you take, <laughs> I believe it is. You take ten damage. Me? Mm-hmm. Fuck. As the head flies out, hitting you square in the nose. Wait, do you have twenty-two health? Have the arm. I have twenty-two health now. <laughs> Shit. The, ar the arm and a fist kind of like oh, puts his knuckles together and flies towards your face, hitting you square in the nose. Shit. Okay. Oh. It was a nat twenty. Oh, okay, okay. That makes sense. That's why I'm not even asking. Yeah, yeah, what I get you. What the fuck uh, is going on? Wraith, it is your turn. What would you like to do? Jerry. Huh. Oh wait, sorry, sorry. Uh, something was happening on my phone. I got distracted. <sighs> uh, I'll cast magic missile on the one in front. All three. Send one to his head and two to the other arms. So is this all in the center guy? Yeah, yeah, all in the, the middle. Okay, so go ahead and roll your damage. As the missiles fly through the air, they all dink different parts of the night, knocking back the parts, leaving just kind of like the arms and the legs out as the chest and the head are knocked back. But they do uh, slowly return back to their normal form. Asriel, it's your turn. What would you like to do? Um... Fuck it. Okay, um, I'm gonna Eldritch Blast and then move away. Like... Go ahead and roll hit. Yeah. 
Does a 15 hit? Nope. And you want to move away? Yeah. Like, behind Wraith, but to the left. Okay. So as you move away, the right arm of the knight kind of flies out to smack you. Mm -hmm. Dealing. Well, let me see something real quick, okay? Yeah. Well, um, oh. so I want you to go to the Nine. character creator. <laughs> I just want to make sure I want to make sure I'm calculating something correctly. Hey, Will, I hope you have another character lined up. <laughs> no, I should be fine actually. Do I have to take away nine, Brady? Okay. Uh. No. Okay. I mean, I miscalculated something. So, uh, Joseph, you are actually allowed to heal yourself by two. I'll probably apologize for that. Uh, why? I miscalculated how crits work. Mm. And you. Will, you get to take uh, 14 damage. Oh, what? Another nat 20? It was a nat, nat 20 with a max roll damage. Holy. That's why I How was much... kind of like, I need to calculate this because I don't want to just. just... It would have been in 14. How much health do you have? Yeah, there's a difference. There's a small difference. Wait, how much health do you have now? I'm at 11. Oh, wow. TPK guys, TPK. <laughs> at this point, at this point, I wouldn't be too I want Ethan back. <laughs> I want Ethan back. I'm kidding. Uh, I'm kidding. By the way, he'll be back. Giri, it is your move. I, uh, Shamaka. <laughs> Go ahead and roll. Let's hey, I hit for once. Uh, <laughs> let's... nineteen. Nineteen. That doesn't need hit. And not one damage. I, I'm saying, I'm saying nineteen because it wasn't a twenty, not twenty. <laughs> okay, uh, and I'm going to, I'm going to, by the way, I'm going to add Divine Smite. I'm going to add uh, one I Divine Smite. Wait, Brody, I said behind Luke to the left. Oh, okay. Did you say behind Giri then? Doesn't matter though, he still would have got smacked. So, Brody, I'm going to, I'm going to roll, I'm going to roll this original damage because it's a plus two. I fucked this up last time. So, plus two and then two more D8s. So, six plus oh my god 6 plus 13 so 19 okay. damage so as you roll your mace into the chest piece you hit the chest piece square in the center kind of indenting it and throwing it back with its head and its head like its and arms falling to the floor and after that you kind of start seeing the radiant energy flow from it okay as your hit is still shock waving <laughs> through it one down boys <laughs> It's not down. Is it down? Uh, yeah. yeah, I just need to delete it. Oh, perfect. Fuck yeah, dude. Okay. Okay. I, I was gonna say, can I yeah. execute this thing if I get to kill it? But uh, it's, uh, now, now with the opening, the other armor walks into the building and not out of out of the building and goes to smack you twice, Joseph. Missing both times. Gary, I'm gonna heal myself. Okay, I'm sorry. I'm not. I'm not giving you my lay on hands. I, I have. As real, it is your turn. My, I know you do. Uh, I, Gary cannot hear you right now. <laughs> okay. You've never seen rock steam this heavily before. You guys are also somewhat in the middle of a hurricane. You what? Wraith's fucking wind. Oh, right, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh huh. Talking over the wind. Um. I'm gonna Eldritch Blast and then that's a, uh. Uh, uh, bonus action, I want to use... Where is it, actually? I want to use my healing hands, not lay on hands. Which is... Actually... Fuck, I'll just do a healing... Uh, lay on hands and heal myself for five points. Okay. But... Yeah. I'll just blast into that. Cool. And... 23. Pog. Not as Pog 6. And then I'll heal. So you kind of dink it on the arm, blowing the arm back as it then recoils back. Go ahead and heal yourself. Uh. Luke? I don't know. 
I might have skipped Luke's turn. Luke, did I skip your turn? No. You probably did. No, because he's after me, isn't he? Yeah. No, no. I'm no? before. He's oh. before. Fuck. You got caught up in your thing and I went with it. Sorry about that. Luke, it is your turn. Sorry about that. You good, you good. I'm just gonna cast Magic Missile again. All three to the head. Fuck it. There we go. Send them all to the head. So as all three kind of hit the head, the head just kind of flies back and hits the wall, but the rest of the armor is still intact. The head does not seem to be recoiling back. Giri, it is your turn. Rush <sighs> mega. Uh, 15 does not hit, huh? 15 does not. Okay. Magic missile is just free damage. Indeed. <laughs> it's good spell. It good spell. <laughs> is it 22 hit? Me? Mm -hmm. Yeah, it does, yes. How the Take fuck are these guys rolling 22? Dude, what? Dude. <laughs> They're getting lucky against me. Brody's dice is fucking, like, weighted. <laughs> Brody has weighted <laughs> dice. I don't give a shit, Brody. You're cheating. You I mean, have weighted, they're weighted dice. but all around. <laughs> nah, I don't, I, I'm calling cap. Fucking uh, make a salt bath and like put them in the water and Dude. see what the fuck happens. If it goes to 20 Dude, each time, that. I'm calling scam. Imagine beating a revenant and then dying to a fucking you know metal <laughs> arm. <laughs> <laughs> okay, they don't uh, gotta burn him like that right now. Wraith, you don't have to kick too. a man while he's down. Wraith, what would you like Didn't, to do? I just went. I just went. I used my magic uh, missiles. I know. It, Gary went, missed his shit, got bashed for it. It's your turn since you're oh. first. That's why I feel like how much, how much damage do I take, Brody? How much damage do I take? Uh, four. Four? Magic missile again, baby! All in the chest! <laughs> Nine damage to the chest. So as you launch all the missiles, the chest is blown back, but it does recoil, unlike the head. Fuck you. <laughs> uh, Azrael, it's your go. What would you like to do? You gotta guess it. Fucking Eldritch Blast. Oh, I was gonna guess die. <laughs> that was a 19 hit. That, that was the spell that yeah. Ethan casted. <laughs> go ahead and roll. Damn. <laughs> <laughs> 11 damage. 11, okay. Really flame. As you hit the chest as it's coming back, you do end up killing the armor as the arms and the uh, legs drop to the floor. Uh, that is that combat. Asked, you guys uh, get. Uh, you guys get 400 XP. Hog. Uh, Dude, this is like it's, it's not worth it. Not worth it. I'd rather have my like friend back. <laughs> and that is where we're that is where we're going to end. Did everyone get his gold? Did everyone get his gold? Did everyone get his gold though? Yeah, we need to. We, I guess I guess we're okay. splitting his gold. You fucking monsters. <laughs> hey, okay. this guy stole it. Would you, you guys like to split his gold? Sure. Yeah, I'm yeah, fine. Yeah, I'm fine. Good with person. It. I'm a good person. Okay, okay that's wow. what you gotta. Wow, that's a little... <laughs> I mean, I mean. To be fair, let's let's think about it from Nornik's perspective. Okay. If he was still here in his dying you guys breath, you get uh, thirty-eight pieces. Yes. How do I add currency? <laughs> go to, and there's go also to... two. There's also two leftover pieces. Oh, here it is. So it's thirty-eight. You guys each get thirty-eight gold pieces with two leftover gold pieces for you guys. Who to wants? Split. I mean, we. Like. 38 gold Who is pieces? the most gold? Thir 38 gold pieces for I have a shit ton. With... You should give the extra to you and, and uh, Gary. We have two left over. I only have 41, I have, so... I have more than that. You should give I it to me. I have 143. How do you okay, have way have more? Please. No, give it to me and... How do you have 100... Oh, wait, I know why. Never mind. I don't spend okay, my gold. I... No, I, I... No, it's because you sold that thing. Yeah, I also okay, sold Okay, can I get the two pieces then? Can I get the two? Yeah, give it to... Give it to Luke. 43 would, gold, guys. I'm almost halfway to you. Would you guys <laughs> like? Would you guys like to take anything else? I'll, I'll uh, hold on. Uh, to match the bodies, okay. I guess. Do the do the bodies have any loot? Uh, the animated armors, no. Okay. What what else does Ethan even have? Does he have rations or some shit? Like, 
Uh, you can look at his character sheet and look yeah, at what can, he has. Yeah, we like can split his shit. Can I have Someone the rope to my Gatling yes. gun he stole? Yes, you can. Someone Fuck take yeah. <laughs> Oh my god, that. wait, does that mean you could take the, the rope back, Will? Yeah, so, so, <laughs> so, Will, you're taking the silk rope and he's gonna have two of them. I guess. I'll take his... Uh, oh, I'll take his leather. Uh... His leather armor? His ink, yeah. My yeah, gun. Actually, my, not my gun. Well, do my I actually do I still works. need leather? Yeah, yeah, I need it for what's it called? My ma ma mage armor. Okay, I'll take his leather armor. I'll take his ink because I need ink. <laughs> this is so <laughs> dark. Really, just, just, just like ooh, free stuff. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck him! He bullied me. <laughs> Fuck him! <laughs> Fuck him! As you have Gary in the corner crying and just, it's just like. <laughs> oh, and then I'll take his, his. I'll take. I'll take his iron pot. I'm gonna need that. Why do you need his iron? iron pot? Okay. Yeah, I need. I need iron. I need Go iron. ahead and add an iron pot to your thing. Okay. Wait. So wait. What were the things I'm adding? Again? You gotta be adding these as I take them away. It was uh ink. An iron pot what? and his leather armor. I'll take his dagger plus one. Okay. All right, he has like, that. I, I was I was there when he. Uh... Yeah, go ahead. Just keep keep adding these to your inventory. I'm not. I'm just taking leather. I'm... I, I'm gonna take things from him that that mean something to me. <laughs> Geary, so Geary is genuinely depressed. <laughs> uh, what was the last thing again? I took Birdie uh, the the, uh, the pot, pot yeah, ink, pot. and the leather armor. Yeah, yeah. Okay, pot iron. By any chance, I can I can get just make that or use it just as iron, right? Like, cause I, one of my spells requires iron. So yeah, just, that'll work. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Cool. Cool. All right. It was a worthy sacrifice. <laughs> I'm also gonna take his back backpipes. <laughs> Anything else you guys want to take? Uh, yeah, I'm looking through real quick. I haven't had much of a chance to look. Oh, Zane's playing Phasmophobia. Hold up, can I? I will also. Can I can I wave my wand to conducting and play a song for the? I have a song. Okay. okay. <laughs> I can't. Wait, are we taking can a I, long rest? Can I right? can I attempt to? Uh... <laughs> just play along. Yeah. Can I attempt to use his bagpipes? What would yeah, that be? Yeah, just play play along with it. Oh, I can use my intro to describe it. Is that me playing? <laughs> no, it's me. It's I started it with it's the, the one of conducting, one. but you can play along. How does how does one? <laughs> well, what, should I roll something for it, or should I just play along? <laughs> it, it's just playing along. Your character can just, is just somewhat trying to copy. Do we burn his body or something? <laughs> how, how do we send him off? Uh, Gary, this is, this is kind of your choice here. I I was gonna say I, I think I think I I think I'll have my I was uh, I'm gonna be completely honest I was connected to, to Nornik the best here. I'm just gonna say that right now. <laughs> no, You're the only person connected to Nornik. <laughs> and as and as him ha having been Gary's one of his only true friends or like mm -hmm. you know someone he enjoys. Uh, I think he wants to spend some time alone. Yeah, but, hey man, you always got no, us. No, but I mean, like, how should we sit? <laughs> Gary, he's dead. I, I don't think he's sleeping. I, I, hold on, I'm gonna fucking turn this music down. <laughs> it's a little hard to take this seriously. Um, I, that was pretty serious, man. <laughs> Wait, why did it turn out for everyone? I don't know. Because it ended, the song ended. If any of you would like to make your peace, make it now. You stole my gold, you asshole. And my feathers. Kind of. 
dumb at times. Wraith, now's not the time to just call. <laughs> One firm kick for the road. It's dumb. Ignorant. I, I, if he kicks, as he kicks him, I grab, his, I grab one of his ankles and just make him do a flip, back flip. Uh, flip him so check. hard. <laughs> Acrobatics. <laughs> um, I don't know. I just, I just, I just vibe there in silence. Maybe I'll mimic one of his old phrases. Who's gonna tell Elro? You suck. <laughs> <laughs> No, 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 I write down in my book. Would you like to know the last thing that he said to me? <laughs> what was the last thing he said to you? I, I mimic him going, yo, give me your fucking feathers. <laughs> okay. It's almost like he's here with us right now. <laughs> Uh, I have uh, one thing I'd like to do with the body. Just, it's a little weird and random, but like, this isn't exactly oh, something. I... This isn't exactly something <laughs> I've uh, as like a religious someone with 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 divine uh, ability. Uh, this is away from everyone. Can I? I, I, I to put it more into, I, I'm just saying. I want. I want to take his body. Uh, <laughs> Carried out. Dude, kidnap him. Dude, under, it sounds so yeah. bad what you're going to say. It sounds no, so bad. No. It sounds I, like you want to kidnap him. No, are there any <laughs> like big, are, are there any like big trees in the area? Uh, there's trees outside of the ice plant. A little farther more inland. I'll carry Where his body to... I'll, I'll carry his body to a tree alone. Uh, and I'll use his shovel dig a hole uh... Right, literally, like uh, next, like in the basically in the roots of the tree, and then bury him there. And as I'm burying him, I touch his body and irradiates with divine light. You you, you touch you touch his you touch his body. What, <laughs> dude? I don't know. I think Geary's a necrophilia. What the fuck? Literally, I'm fucking... <laughs> he's not denying it. Okay. I'm trying to be respectful. Shit, fuck. All right, come and, down. Uh, and, with, and with that, the session. Shall end with Nordic's body. Uh, that sounded like a under. very successful session, guys. That very was a very successful. successful. Yeah, that's successful. All right, now, Ethan, you gotta come back as an Earth Genasi. <laughs> <laughs> so